not. Empire D&D. Now it's on. Is everyone ready to go? No. Last time, we did <laughs> shopping. That was pretty cool. We did like four hours of shopping. Yeah. Why did you guys say four hours? I haven't even been, I just think I, didn't I need to shop. The thing is, no, no, no. It, we went through everything, selling and keeping. And oh, stuff it was like looking that. up all the prices you get for yeah. all the items. That's yeah. what took me. Because you had both me and Marcus looking up stuff in the GMG to figure out prices. At least that went kind of quick. It was just a matter of going yeah. through everything. Well, I didn't record that anyway, so. Thank God. To the audience, last time on D&D, they got back from uh, the middle of nowhere. Now yeah. they just went to the free city to buy stuff. And now. I have 34 AC. I don't suck anymore. Now we'll I see. Have higher than me. Ah. My ground. What is the first action of our party? To become a god. Kill it with fire. Uh, well, we I just, guess, well... Should we go rest, or...? We already did rest. This is, like, after... When we shop, I'm assuming we went to, like, the free city talking yeah, to you don't, guy you don't, rested. You don't go to the shop bleeding from everywhere. <laughs> yeah. My god! Because <laughs> then he's going to rob you. Hey, evil wizard guy, we're totally coming to your store half dead and, you know, totally he loaded take with... What even like... level is a shop owner? Over and under. <laughs> remember, I remember asking when we were when I was Eden and, like, a lower level, and I was like, can we take him? And you said, well, all of you could take him together, but Adam's outside being a bitch. And I was like, oh, okay, so we couldn't, but as a team we might. Hi. But now that he's super powerful and owns a shop that is basically the most glamorous thing in the world, I'm having a feeling that we are going to get we our asses We kind of turned him 20th level. I think he's a money. lich, just in disguise. <laughs> he's just like, I'm rotting under here. Well, he has enough money to be a lich now. <laughs> he's got more like a dragon. <laughs> a Draco lich. Yeah. He's Draco. <laughs> that would be funny. That would be hilarious that we were buying and selling everything with Dragotha. <laughs> I'll grab him a bit. What? Oh, oh, that was nice. Okay. And that, yeah, the ice cube is totally what I want to. Okay. Also, turn the TV up. Just because of power. Well, let's think about it. We were sent to this island by Lashona, so could we assume that we would need to speak with Lashona? Uh, Lashona, who we just witnessed in the past getting killed. You mean the same Lashona who sent us on the mission in the first place after we saw her getting killed? No, no, we didn't different... see her get killed. We saw her go out, uh I'm pretty dropped. sure we saw Dragotha rip her neck open. Well, he, it could get better. Giant sky battle. She gets dropped. Were they over the water or something? No, they fell. No, she fell into uh, the Rift Canyon, which is really deep. I'm but she's I'm under. Sorry, a, I'm assuming she gets. Dead I said that dropped. last time. I said that she. I even. But that was a that. while ago, like fifteen hundred years ago. I still said it though. I remember when I was sitting there. I'm like, I bet you anything. I, what if she's undead? And everyone's like, No, nah, she got resurrected. And now everybody's saying she got the fuck you up. <laughs> now everyone, now everyone's thought about it and like, oh, maybe she's well, she on dead, or maybe she got resurrected. Does anybody have to tech on dead or anything like that? Uh, I can walk up to her and use vampiric touch and see if it works. My job description is to kill things the fire, heal people, and that's it. Walk up to Lashona. Hey, Lashona. Yeah. You guys are touch. ready for battle, not for diplomacy. <laughs> well, Ray is ready for diplomacy. I'm oh, ready man. for talking with people about intricate things about religion and arcane. Kind of. I am ready. Uh, for did you want to stop by? Uh, did you want to stop by Alhaster then? Eve's not with you. <laughs> we're kind of already. Well, we're going to be in the area. We so should probably did we just? Uh, well, we might as well go back. But the problem is, is am I allowed back in the city? I thought I was not allowed. Uh, you can visit. Oh. You just can't live there anymore. Oh, fair enough. <laughs> you are not allowed to own land. Uh, so I think that what we should do is, if we get the chance, is actually <laughs> visit her. Uh, by the way, this. Yeah, you said uh, roll a knowledge, uh, knowledge history check for who is smart, right? Uh, uh, I already told you everything there is to know about it, pretty much. Oh, uh, did you? You can make it a, yeah. Uh, oh. It's a ruined city built into the northern cliff side of the Rift Canyon. So all we have to do is find our way to the Rift Canyon. Pretty much. Do we know where that is? Uh, yeah, it's a pretty big feature. Oh, okay. Then never mind. I will not be rolling anything. It's like a couple hundred miles across. So I guess now that our party is down to four, we just teleport with our teleporter? We're just gonna teleport straight there. I'm assuming so. Yeah. That would. Mm, you don't know. Well, you don't have even have pictures. No. But uh, teleport back uh, to around where Luciana's house used to be, where Commodore Fuzzy Paws is now living. Hey, Commodore okay, Fuzzy Paws. So, because you teleported well, there a couple times before. I'm the captain of this house. <laughs> Made of dice. Shut up. <laughs> Like resting on my leg, weird. 
Oh, wait, let me mm -hmm. see. Uh, that'll probably do it, just let me check. Okay. He decides to switch it up. Anything between 1 and 25 is an instant kill. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, you're all like, what? I I'm a horrible said, DM. <laughs> I wanted to end this early. <laughs> he just claps his hands and leaves, like, Marcus, what the, what the fuck was that? I don't know, I just got tired. <laughs> oh, okay, never mind. Yeah, you're I'm good. Just not feeling so, you yeah, I'm very familiar with your house. Pew. Well, I would imagine so. Somebody got gooped there. It's kind of hard to forget. Your house. Of course, it's Commodore Fuzzy Paws. I sold it to him. For 10,000 10, gold! <laughs> da, da, da. <laughs> yeah. Don't give me that. No, I'm <laughs> I know the eyebrows. Okay, anyway, yes, let's go to, uh, that was fucking weird. No, let's go see, uh, Lashona and tell her about what we heard. Alright, uh, you approach Lashona's house. Uh, it appears to be more heavily guarded than usual. There's uh, two guards um, standing in front of the door, in front of the, or the, there's like several guards actually stand, sitting in front of the, uh, main entrance, and they're just like, mm. You really sure you want to talk to her? Damn straight I do. She I sent her, stay out here. She sent us on this mission, we gotta at least talk to her. Alright, I'm gonna walk up to the guards. I am having a mental conversation with the comedy to decide whether or not we want to join you. Uh, I, I'm just gonna I, talk to them. I'm not attacking them. There's Lagi. We're here to see Lashona. Lashona, Lady Lashona, uh, has gone into hiding. Yeah. Why? She must avoid the attention of her enemies for the time being. Do you happen to know which enemies these might be? No. You suck. By the way, why are you guarding a house if she's gone into hiding? It is her property. What more? That you're... We've had a rash of thefts lately. Huh. I don't know if you were laughing or if you were hiccuping like, right there. Oh, All her was... both. Oh, okay. Yes, nobody can look at me now. <laughs> <laughs> Unless she came back to start stealing. <laughs> that pit means a whore. Ah. <laughs> pit means a pimp. <laughs> and Orange is a whore. Anyway. Um. Sad she stole the hand, she stole the rod. What else does she want? Anyway, uh, don't give me that. Yes, <laughs> what's this? Anyway. Alright, if she's gone, then I guess we won't bother you any longer. Good. Alright. Now what? Want to just go to Kuluthmar? Why don't we just Field ask trip. them to give her a message? Kuluthmar is the, is the city way down in the tropics that you went to, the ruined one. Uh, you're going to Kongenthunir. Which is. Try what, saying that what, do I keep, what do I keep saying? Kuthmar? Kuthmar, which is the big temple place. Yeah, which is where which is where Hughes became a god. Basically. Oh! Damn it! And we're going to Kongingmar? Kongin Thulnir. So Kung Donkey Kong Thulnir. land. Okay, so we're going the to the city Kong of Kung kings. Thank right, you. Alright, so how are we getting there? Well, do you know how to get there? Wait, we might be able to find a picture somewhere. Manzorian. We just. I was thinking Manzorian. Okay, we, we can go visit the Weedress people. Please note. According to other fluff or DM fluff, I'm not sure at this point in time because I do not know the campaign setting. The We Justins here may not own a picture because they are either forbidden to have the picture or everyone in the city is too indulgent. I know they have a library and it saves a teleport spell. Menzorian. Yeah, Menzorian or the We Justins there would work. I'm serious, Nine. like in Mage Point. Mage Point. That would be a 58. For men. You make it to Mage Point. Yeah. Alright, so what are we doing now Master at Mage Point? Uh, going straight to Manzorian and asking if he has a picture to Donkey Kong. Yes, yes. So as we walk up to Donkey Yes. Ding, ding, ding. Hmm? Hello? We're here to see Manzorian. Okay. That was easy. Mine fits. Not He's like been able to show him. He's been, he's been Meander. more or less staying around, doing research and such. Oh, good stuff. Like Is he busy? He's always busy. Well, fair enough. Do you think he'd mind if we visited? Probably, but he'll let you come in. Okay, thank you. Michael's not with you, is he? No. Okay. No boost today. It's like, thank God. <laughs> oh, guys, Michael's not here. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> Do you want something for it? No, I'm fine. Thank you for a Right. Your couch partner must be not so shrill. <laughs> anyway, okay. 
Um, is it bad when you can scream higher pitch than I can? No. You make it all the way up to Menzorian's Tower. Uh, the first person you see is is uh, Celeste flipping through a book. Okay. Yeah. I swear I read this book before, but now there's all these different things in it. I think did, did sure. Luciana and uh, Armel just have a moment where they're like, <laughs> like Celeste, <laughs> different book. <laughs> no, I'm just because we released the information. Yeah. Hello. Hello, Hello. What are you doing here? We. We get to visit Pansorian. <laughs> we need to know if you guys have a picture of a certain place so we can teleport ourselves there. Oh, you mean like. Oh, you mean Menzorian's magical portraits. Yep. Uh, what is the place? I'll look through it for you. What's the name, Owen? Donkey Kong Country. <laughs> I know it's like Kong. Oh, City of Kings. The giant's town in the side of the Rift Canyon. Oh, Kong and Thulnir. That thing, yes. Oh, okay. Uh, give me a minute. I can look through this. And she she wanders off. She like she starts. She never returns. <laughs> she has lost so her many portraits. Where did she go? She goes into a vault, opens it up, goes through this like huge. Uh, Selection of, of, of uh, magic paintings. You know what I'm picturing now? It's just, <laughs> just like she just on. opens one. She's like, Heh. "It's Joe's house." <laughs> There's like a painting of every single location in this vault. That would be creepy. <laughs> no, it'd be creepy if it was like a giant book where you're just like flipping the pages. Well, actually, I actually think it'd be actually cool. P P like the paintings are the pages. So it's like, and it's like look. a pop-up book. <laughs> <laughs> and look, it's Steve Jobs. <laughs> You never oh! <laughs> having a picture of every place would be creepy, but having a picture of every house and every place and every room that is in that house would be even creepier. Google map. <laughs> <laughs> Good. The Mansorian's place is the Google Maps. That's what you're called. You, you never know what you'll find, you know. What place, what ancient ruins might have special uh, special meaning to places. I mean, you think that, uh, you think that Kulith Mar, you think that people didn't laugh at him for wanting to have a picture of some ancient, long-forgotten ruin? Who's laughing now? We're stopping the Age of Worms because of it, aren't we? Yep. Well, we are. I'm helping. She's helping. I'm kidding. Manzorian is helping, too. Oh, I know ah. who it is. Near, City of Kings, Giants, you say? This should do the trick. It's just yeah. like a picture of a giant going like... So he teleports like, oh, <laughs> shit! <laughs> <laughs> He's been waiting there all the time. He's like, like <laughs> she walks over, she hangs it up. Uh, it's basically what you would expect. It's it's a view from the other side of the canyon, uh, looking at a, a city that's just sort of, you know, yeah. built I inside of it. I studied intently. Alright. you need anything else here? Or are you... uh, if we're done all of our shopping and stuff like that, are I think you gonna we're talk, Were you going to ask about the demon? Or the devil? Actually, yeah, we were going to ask about the picture. Do you happen to have, have a picture, picture where... Um, last time we were here, uh, before we entered town, well not last time, the very first time we were about to come here, we were attacked by a pit thief yeah. that demanded the, uh... What? <laughs> Nothing, it's, did you actually do that in character the whole... Oh, no. Okay, I thought that was in character, that's why Luciana was like... Mm -hmm. No. <laughs> but no. Um, we remember. Uh, yeah, well he kind of showed up again. Yes? And he took the hand of Vecna. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that is very not good. We wanted it. I still want it. So, mm -hmm. we want a way to kill this son of a bitch. And if you can help us, or if anybody can help us, we would greatly appreciate it. Mm -hmm. Also, we would be happy to, we would be willing and quite happy to donate the piece of the Rod of Seven that we would rip from his body. Mm hmm. Hmm, well, if he has a piece of the Rod of Seven parts, um, it might be uh, more useful in your hands, uh, especially if no one else is looking for it. Well, Manzorian has one of the pieces already, and it's the largest, the one that we gave him. So if we can continue giving him pieces, then the place is, the safest place I can think of is with Manzorian. That's true. That or inside of Kami's armor, because nothing's getting through that! <laughs> you just see, like, <laughs> like so That was totally in character, by the way. <laughs> it's like, it's like, man! <laughs> no, no, I'm sorry just because what Kami's <laughs> wearing that makes it funny. Yeah, he's I'm wearing, actually wearing armor. studs, yeah. <laughs> and then minion on his head. <laughs> the most epic hat Great ever. Crotch. The fact that he could become a hat is amazing. 
Anyway, I'm sorry. I didn't, mean, I didn't mean to jump off of that tangent. Are you going to hit me with that? That's what Bray bought it for me for. To hit people? <laughs> hey, man. Just poke them. Ah, okay. Um, <laughs> anyway. For all the listeners, our DM is just hitting his hand with his cane, just threatening us now. You know, no good. I Send can't, help. I can't wait until Aki sees that. I mean, that's going to go so well. Okay, uh, let's see. Oh, she's like, I um... I can't say it for him. I'll have to call him over. Manzarian. <laughs> what? <laughs> they they uh, they like to know about that that pit fiend from earlier. What about it? Um, something about wanting to kill it. Uh, Dead. In in some fashion. Apparently they've uh, apparently it uh, it claimed the soul of one of their uh, one of their friends oh, in the hand of Vecna. He was scrying. Oh, <laughs> that son of a bitch! He's just like watching. He's like, uh, and then she stole the hand of Vecna. <laughs> you fucking. Anyway, continue. Did they I'm sorry. Session? <laughs> <laughs> he's like watching. That's the verse of scrying. That's pretty. That's pretty cheating, man. Cheating. YouTube. <laughs> oh dear God! Uh, I'm gonna YouTube their party so I'm ready. <laughs> All right, uh, Manzorian walks in. He's like, oh. Alright, that pit fiend. Uh, well, I can't kill him for you. We don't want you to kill him for us. I want to kill him myself. That, um, that might be difficult. He is in possession of two very powerful artifacts. Now, uh, what I can do, because there are restrictions, unfortunately, that I'm, uh, that I'm under, uh, just agreements between me and other forces, I could... Uh, gate the pit fiend in, and he will have to. Uh, he will have to at least listen to what I have to say. But he needs to. Uh, he he needs to have some sort of agreement. Uh, if if he were to do battle, uh, I will have to offer him uh, my piece of the rod of seven parts, uh, and then ask him to do battle with you in exchange for his artifacts. I have a better idea. As we're in no rush to actually fight this pit fiend, and we still have to f stop the Age of Worms, what if we gather the rest of the rod? Is it possible for you to discern the location of the other parts? I have to do quite a bit of looking around. We would gladly be... Honestly, I kid you not when I say this. If we find any pieces, we would bring them straight to you. They would all go to you. And if ever we required the rod... If we ever used it, it would go straight up to you after we were done with it. I thought this was about the pit fiend. Oh, we want him dead. In fact, what I would like to have is the hand of Vecna. I could care less about the rod. The rod could be keep it kept by you, and you could use whatever, do whatever you want with it. Because honestly, what does the rod do? The rod is the rod of seven parts is like this huge magical artifact. It's like super epic and shit, right? It has but the one piece that we had was like heals for free. Yeah. Well, free ones per day. But if we're going to use it, then we might as well just use it like once against Ragotha or like Qs or any kind of boss. You can get spellcasters in your party that can use rods. Yeah, but this is a guy who's super powerful who, if we offer him this, this is a better deal. Because if he does stuff for us for the Rod of Seven, it's going to have a better benefit than giving you guys rods when you already have like 400 as it is. As That's I see like it, three or four. the last time we gave him a piece of a rod, he gave us each a $40,000 worth of items. Mm. So if we give him all the pieces, monies, items, happiness, if we want, we give him all the pieces, he offers the largest piece before putting them all together. He's still got, if it's seven parts, right? It's broken into seven? Okay. That's why it's called that. Yeah, I just wanted to make sure. <laughs> so we have one. Bitfiend has one. Mm. We collect six. Now, Manzorian says, I have the largest piece. I'll challenge, they challenge you for this. By the time that we get all the pieces, if we're that high level, then if a pit fiend comes, even with Aryan's help, a rod and Vecna's hand, we'll cut him to pieces and then sacrifice him to whatever god we feel like, just for lulls. I know, I'm just saying, relics are super awesome, so don't be so quick to hand them away without talking with everybody. I'm, well, that's what I'm saying. We use it when we need it against, like, Dragotha or, like, Hughes or something, but after we're done, what do we need it for? Then we give it to him. This 
So... So what did you need my help with again? Oh, right. <laughs> I... Do you know... Well, yeah, can he find the other pieces of the rod? It would take quite a bit of searching. I'd prefer to focus my efforts on the Age of Worms as of mo at the moment. What if we focus on the Age of Worms and you focus on the rod? Believe me, you need my help. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> yeah, you don't have a good argument for that one. What if we just, like, find one piece that we can go in an order? Do you think it would be a useful item? It would be a useful item, but at the moment, in time, we are in haste mode at the moment. You know what, I'm not enough. saying that you won't eventually be strong enough to defeat the pit feet, uh, if that is your intention. Oh, I plan to be the one to shift my sword right down his throat. But, um... Uh... At the moment, I, I will keep my ears open for any other pieces of the Rod of Seven that, uh, that, that come our way. But, um, all that I can offer at the moment is, uh, I can bring the Pit Fiend in, and I can have, and I can have a deal set with him that if he defeats you in combat, uh, he will get my piece of the Rod of Seven parts. And, uh, if you defeat him, of course, he will be dead, and he will, uh, he will likely have his, uh, his artifacts with him for the fight. Hmm. Well, in that regard, we might as well postpone the fight until after we're done with these giants. Yes. I. I was, well, giants aren't exactly the most pleasant of people, so we have to we go and kill ourselves a nation of giants, aren't we? To war! <laughs> well, let's, let's see if there's any other Alternative, options. Alternative, yeah. Instead of just running in there, oh, we're just going to yeah, kill it. No, no, that, let's do this smartly. So I guess, uh, all right. I guess you're right. We should focus on the Age of Worms. Hmm. Oh. He smiled. I'm just kidding. Uh, it is unfortunate to hear about um, Aryan, though. <laughs> What's his face? What's her face? I had a feeling that something might have been wrong. Um. Okay. Um... <laughs> So is there anything that you would uh, uh, like before you before you get sent off? Um, like her. Can you buff us? No. Can you upgrade our stuff for free? Make you shinier? Well, no. Uh, you know what? If that is <laughs> that is a really silly question to ask in character, yeah. <laughs> Could you cast any defensive or offensive spells on us that would last uh, for a I decent amount of time? Yes. <laughs> no, you know what I mean, like power ups. Yeah. Like, can you can you power us up for the for when we go over? And will they be able to last a while? I suppose so, just a moment. Finally, I asked a good question! <laughs> Asking the Archmage um, to power us up? That is awesome. It's funny when you're like, um, or when you're like, um, can you give us anything else? I can say, Arian's eyes shift towards Orion's bow. You have to earn bow. that back. Mm hmm. Hmm? My bow. You need to earn, earn it back. When you earn the trust of the party, you earn the trust of the bow. Until such time, the bow is in the possession of the one who can break every neck. As I have a 41 strength. Except like Kami's defense. Because his huh? back is armor. That's freaking insane. Yeah, I love it. And you know what? It's only going higher. I will, I will challenge a red dragon to an arm wrestle once this campaign is done. I will walk into a den. I'll be like, RED DRAGON! Oh. I challenge thee to yeah. an arm wrestle. But you, you, you know why you won't do it? Hmm? I am far away. As soon as I get the book of plus five, I shall be ahead of it by one. But you know. <laughs> but you know why you'll <laughs> lose oh that? Hmm? You'll look at the you'll look at the red dragon. He'll size you up, and then he'll make you believe that you you are needed back somewhere else. Or just tell you that he's a bunny, and you'll believe that he's a bunny with this plus forty-five yeah, bluff check. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Fucking dragon. Yeah, the red which... dragon has this gratuitous bluff check for no reason. So if he ever wants one day, if you decide to burst into his cave and try to kill him, if he feels hungry that day, he'll be like, "Oh look, something that's even worse than me." Where? Nom nom nom. <laughs> or he'll just be like, "If today I'm bored, I don't feel like doing anything. I'm a bunny. I'm useless. Go away." Yeah, it's no fun being Jack. <laughs> Oh god. Kid not! Sorry, he's like, hey, look, bunny! Oh, good for two of them, Yeah, I'm a bunny. Ooh, bunny. No, 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 you know what's be ridiculous? This bunny is scaly and feels like a dragon! Red dragon versus caboose. Oh dear god. No, they're blocked. I'm a bunny! It is a bunny! 
<laughs> Caboose is like, I'm a bunny. The dragon's like, huh. I'm a bunny too! You're the ugliest goddamn bunny I ever did see. <laughs> I'm a bunny too. Must be friends. Well, you're a really big bunny. You're a really small bunny. Big brother? Alright. <laughs> if it ever was that easy, it wouldn't they be. They are sorcerers. They are. Next you know, Caboose is the Natsu of our group. He is the fairy tale fire character of our No, 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 no. Trained and raised by a dragon. That's what I'm saying, is that this dragon would look I like... I have the red dragon heritage! The point that I'm trying to make is the scenario we just had. Oh. Where they both say they're bunnies, they believe each other, and the red dragon is like, I am the big brother dragon. I mean bunny. bunny. And then the Caboose is like, I am the little bunny. Now we are brothers. <laughs> and now the big bunny will train the little bunny to be like the big bunny, and then when they're done... We've got ourselves a dragon slayer. What? Big kitty little kitty. Exactly. Big kitty little kitty. Big little kitty. Oh my god, I love that. Mikasa e Sukasa. Exactly. <gasps> Quick pro quo. Medifloria. <laughs> no! I'm just throwing, no, I'm just throwing shit out there. What are you looking for? Buffs? Uh, pretty much, yeah. That will last for hours? Days. Actually, weeks. Dunna, dunna, dunna. Decades. Centuries. Millennia. Millennia. Yes. What was that song that started with? Bananas. <laughs> Fruit flies like an arrow. Or, time flies like an arrow. Fruit flies like an arrow. <laughs> New dice? Yes. New dice. Oh, those are pretty. Red and black? Red and black. Red and black and death. Sixteen. The strongest. Yeah, that's good dice. Yep. Yeah. I'm strongest. I can't really think of any enchantments I can cast on you that uh, stone skins, protection from energy that you don't already have yes but then if you cast them it's like you're getting them for free and they last longer because you're higher level that's how it works it, it's, like, it's, like, it's like an hour per caster level and because he's an archmage it's going to be like 400 right you mean because I'm stronger duh I mean, you're of stronger, course. You're a stronger mage than me, so they last longer. Please, Gandalf the way. I mean, Mantori. Gandalf the Grey. Gandalf the Grey isn't that strong. I like Gandalf the Grey. His beard is Gandalf. Grandel. <laughs> He's like a granddaddy, anyway. Anyway. Oh, okay. Ah! I'm too excited about this. Well, if he casts, like, super, super stone skin and we get, like, DR20, then I'm gonna love it. Oh, dear. DR anything is awesome, so <laughs> lay it on me. Are you kidding? If I get DR, then I'll run for And everything wields adamantine hammers, and it makes no diff. Well, then I will hit him with my Shadow Striking Sword and break through all of their DR and rip out their innards and wear them as hairnets. That would be disgusting. So wait, you're going to sell, Luciana's suddenly going to have braids made out of intestines? No. Dreadlocks of intestines? No, she's That's actually crazy. not. She's not that gross. Dreadlocks now, my them. orc in your campaign totally is. He would wear hair. He would wear people's organs as hairnets and then eat them. Because he's an evil orc. Yes. Mm, yes. Anyways, moving on. I need a war horn for you. Long time. Time. Yes, let's go. Just extended stone time. skin. Extended protection from fire. Ooh. Okay, so that's DR time. And that's... How long do we get this stuff for? The day. He has a oh. magic that, that makes it last the day. And protection from energy, it's fire, dead. and I think it was... The highest I could go was like 96, the highest you could go was 100 and something, so... What? 150. 150 is the max. Okay, so 150, I guess. So Is that for everyone in the party? Yeah. Um, he can't do everyone. Um, he'll do the uh, the close combat guys, though, so you two. Oh, so the two of us get the DR and the resist? Yeah. Okay, sweet. So DR plus 10? Uh, we get DR 10, so that means when anything hits us, we uh, 
Uh, yeah, and then he's also given us uh, basically. I want to make sure you don't. We can take 150 uh, fire damage. But you don't die in a way that's inconvenient. So. so. Yeah. Uh, here you take this scroll. Uh, it's a time stop. Oh, oh god! god! Oh no! Oh no! That is awesome. That that. Thank you. This no, is very why is that? Oh no, that's awesome. The fact that oh, our team has a scroll of time stop. I can't wait. Fair enough, but. Use it in the best possible time. That'll be so good. I'm sorry, it's just the sort of way with time stop. It only lasts for a few turns, I think, at most. Three turns, you get think three of the turns to, would... to kind of break the... You, three turns to act. Mm -hmm. Dude, if those three turns weren't just used to wail on something, then I would use those three turns for super buffing, and then uh, as soon as it comes back... Unfortunately, like... time stop doesn't allow you to affect uh, the outside environment. It oh, so it's you like... can affect yourself, and you can move. Okay, so it'd be like buffing and getting the perfect position. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Sweet. And if you're a real dick, you can use the late blast fireball several times and wait for the time stop to run out. <laughs> Three, two. Yeah, I think we have that. Oh, but that's, yeah. uh That's kind of a loophole. Uh, I don't know if I'll allow it. Yeah. You know, all the, the damn sure allow super loopholes like that. Like the uh, 56 strength loophole or the super master many forms loophole or. But. Yeah. Anyway, pun pun stuff. Mm -hmm. So. What else did he give us? So he gave the time stop, he gave us the DR. He gave you the, the two enchantments, that's about it. Okay, so are we good to go then? I guess so. <laughs> I'm good to go. And for Cage, a lock of my hair. Because of in Lord of the Rings Fellowship of the Ring, <laughs> when the the elf ship was giving out the uh, the gifts, it's like, here's a knife for you guys, here's elven rope, here's this, this, and this. And then when it was Gimli, it's like, and if you could ask for anything, what would it be? And he's like, I want a hair. And she's like, here's three. And he's like, eh, eh. Huh. so because you're a dwarf, that was that was my point. Oh yeah, right. I, I I'm like, yeah. are you going? Yep. Okay. Yeah. Common Thilnir. I can tell by the fact that you actually pulled out the Common Thilnir picture. Oh yeah, you know the picture that says Common Thilnir on it. Yeah. <laughs> Good guess. Good luck with that. <laughs> See you later, Mazorian. Goodbye. Thank you. So much. I love this guy seriously. <laughs> He gives right. you stuff. Of course you like him. Well, I don't Everyone like him ready, He's pretty funny, too. Mm -hmm. I've studied this picture for as long as we've been talking. Mm -hmm. Did Every you ever blink once? Your eyes are like bloodshot. No! <laughs> as we have all the items we need. Everyone's good. Everyone's ready. Oh, yeah. I'm good to go. We're good to go. Deal. Everyone. I don't actually not get more to like that. Because everyone touched me. <laughs> Fine. You stay here when I teleport. Actually, we gotta leave Menzorian's mansion first, and then teleport. Yes, don't try teleporting inside. Didn't we do that last time? No. No, you did. We knocked outside. We went outside. Okay. Then we grab the picture and go outside. Let us teleport soon. Actually, no. Wait. Yeah. Sorry. You can do it. You can do it in, in in the study. You can't teleport in. That's what it is. Yeah. So we can teleport out of here, but we can't teleport in. So yeah. Yes, is everyone ready to go? Yeah. So say what you gotta say. Are we Ooh. touching you or not? That would be a thirty-two. You make it. I'm guessing you just you go to. Uh, well, I'm assuming we're gonna land on the cliff out across from it. Right? Yeah, yeah. All right. Here's what you guys see: an arid wasteland, broken only by the occasional rock formation or cups of scrub oaks, stretches to the horizon in all directions save one. In this direction, the land drops away into the immense gulf of the Rift Canyon. It stretches as far as the eye can see to the east and west, a boggling gash in the face of the world. The wind blowing over the strange rock formations, perched on the canyon's lips, makes a hollow moaning sound. One hundred feet below the top of the cliff, an immense ruined city of stone lies nestled in the wide open cavern. Hundreds of multi-level buildings and towers rise inside this cavern, creating a vertical cityscape of spires, battlements, and stone bridges. Spires of rock protruding precariously from the cliff's tower right face rise up before the cityscape. Some of these spires are barren, capped only by the odd bush or rock formation, but two support large castles of their own and connect to the main city via slender bridges of stone. Smoke rises from several parts of the ruined city, and many of the buildings are recently damaged or destroyed. The source of this damage is readily apparent, for the city of Kongenthulnir is under siege by dragons. That is awesome. 
Well, we'll just leave it to him. Uh, all right. The so city of giants is under siege by dragons. And we're in the middle of it. So we're gonna go fight dragons and giants. There be dragons. Right. I will appoint myself leader and charge. Okay, um, you go in charge. Rest of the party will stay uh, back here. I'm following behind you. Yeah. Uh, here's Hi. a map of the city as you see it. Um, Where are we? You're over here. Oh. You're in the far, far side. That's of the not hands. water, is it? No, it's just blackness. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, it's just a bottomless pit. Don't worry, it's not water. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, the main entrance, uh, from what you can see, is a set of stairs up in the north end here. Okay. Uh, that go down from the top of the cliff. So I guess, do we make our way there? Uh, if you want to. Um, is that the only entrance we can see? Well, what the hell? I can fly. You can fly over to it. Yeah, sure. Fuck it. I'll pick you Just guys up. Just be like, hey, guys. What's up, my brethren? <laughs> How's your dragoning going? Okay, totally. Let's do it. If you're trying to be sarcastic, I'll just punch a dragon as we fly by. Okay. It. I'm kidding. <laughs> no, please. Go ahead. <laughs> this is going to end I'll, so I'll do hard. a stealth check. At, like, negative 50 while I'm holding, like, a red dragon on my back and then a dwarf. And a berserker. <laughs> a dwarf tentacle beast. And so we can't see the bottom of it at all, right? Um, I wouldn't want to. Well, you imagine... Well, yeah, it, it's... It's semi-visible. It's just shaded. Uh, it's not uh, It's not bottomless or anything, but it's really jagged and deep. So we couldn't go down there and find a, a shaft that goes up into it, could we? Probably not. The, it's, the city is basically built closer to the top half of the, of the canyon. I was wondering if there are mines or shafts that go down towards the bottom. You don't see anything, but you could uh, you could make uh, you can make checks to to observe uh, different uh, various parts of the city. Let me see here. Uh huh. This chapter is a little bit convoluted, oh. but it's pretty fun looking. Well, yeah, dragon and giant fighting. <laughs> Alright, we gotta go inside there, and we gotta kick some giant ass, and we gotta kick some dragon ass, then we gotta burn oh, this place yeah, to here. the ground. Uh, you can make a spot check if you want. 25. Just enough. Wow, nice. Uh, you can make an estimate on the number of uh, dragons attacking in the in this raid. Uh, you see about a dozen black dragons, uh, ten green dragons, and about half a dozen uh, big blue dragons. And uh, um, you see one or two dragons just uh, floating about that are different. No clue what they are, though. Yeah. Uh, oh, come on, we can take them. Let's see here. We totally can take them. Okay. Do this shit, man. I will stealth. <laughs> like whistle down the tube. Come on! Show your moves, Firestorm. Oh, wait, we got resistance 150. I have Firestorm. I know I'm casting it. There's nothing up there is resistant against fire. It's acid, lightning. I'm immune to lightning! I attack the blue dragons. <laughs> okay, so you're immune to their breath, what about their bite, their claw, well, that, and their wing? It's a, I'm about as immune to those as they are to my sword, and my sword hurts more. He oh. just has Bane dragons on it. Ah, no, there you go. Oh. I thought you still had dragons. Uh, you I can, had dragon stuff. Yeah, I guess you can let me know where you want to uh, park yourselves. I actually missing you, don't get. Like I said, the entrance is a stairway in the north end. So I guess we just come down the stairs then, because I can't think of any other way, because I don't want to fly in if there's dragons all over the place. Yeah, no, we're, we're going to be taking a ground route. So stairway, stairway it is. Alright, I guess we're making our way to the well, stairway. I guess we're on a question. What stops us from rappelling down to the top of cliff face? Uh, the, the big black chasm. No, but I mean if we came around to this side. Because we have to go all the way around. If you actually see where we are on the map, you see all that stuff. I know, stuff we're on the like, other side. Yeah, so we have to go all the way around. I know, we're going all the way around anyway to get to the stairs. Because these yeah. are the stairs here, right? Yeah, well, up there. Top right corner. 
You see that law, like thin little black line up in the top corner? Up, up, that. Yeah, you see, up, that. Oh, That's okay. the stairway. So, oh, yeah, I don't understand the stairway. What does it stop from saying coming over here and, like, we're going down? That because way. we have to get that way first. It's it's us going up the well, mountain. There's nothing really down. stopping you um, from going anywhere. You can go wherever, you can start wherever you want. I'm just saying, like, walk along here and then rappel down on top of a building. Or dimension door. Or dimension door. Actually, yeah, we're perfect party size for your dimension. It is. I can carry three people with me. That works. Fuck. We are all tactical today. We are. Uh, so I guess so I. The get problem the... is they they know the staircase is there, so. Yeah, we, they, they might have guards. <laughs> Sneaking in would be pretty easy if we just dimension door in. It's just where do you want us to go? Point. To, no, I'm not. I'm not choosing where we go. You point to where you want to go, and the dimension door says we can go there. It's the awesome thing about dimension doors. It says you just have to go. Uh, how far is your dimension door? It's your caster level. It's 760. I remember that. 760 feet. The problem is the stairs by which you want to come down, it looks like there's a huge gate. Then I'll break it. Do you honestly think there's a gate um, that I cannot destroy? Well, there's a long way around Compared the to gate. the... Uh, comparatively to the city, you can make it about... Uh, with that dimension door, you can make it about halfway across its uh, length. I can make it halfway across that city? Yes, with a dimension door. I don't think you can make it across the canyon with just one, though. No. So we have to, we still have to go over by the stairs, then? Not necessarily. You can fly close, and then hopefully See. not get caught. Okay, so <laughs> if if I, if we take away the option of flying, then the only other option is the stairs? Uh, without flying, yes. Okay, then I'm not flying, so um. we might as well take the stairs. If, if we get to the door, we'll just If we can see the place that we want to go to, I know it'll be a bit of a waste of spell, but why don't we just teleport there? Uh, because teleport is a chance of failure if they've only been, if they haven't even been there once. Mm. So if they use, if, if she uses a teleport spell and fucks up, then we can become one being. I really don't want to do that. Mm -hmm. Well, I'd get my bowl back. Get the fuck out of here. What's this random island with like a gem on it? Huh? The random island with a gem on it. Uh, that's... Uh, I think that's a little fortress. Let's see. Ray's like, I want a base. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's a, it's a tower. Uh, sitting on top of a, a big, of a stone pinnacle. I miss the rest of island towers. Okay, I'm in favor of oh, just going... Trying. I'm in favor of going down the stairs. <laughs> yeah, sure, stairs work. And then if we get down the stairs and we see something, we can just dimension door behind a building or something and hide for a bit. Or we can go in guns blazing. I don't give a shit either way. Just light half the city on fire. The people can burn. Keep close enough that I can teleport out in one turn. Yeah, fair enough. All those spells, I'll just dimension door halfway across the city and be like, Woo! And I'll just be like, Oh! Oh yeah, that's the problem. You're oh! talking the front. <laughs> I'll stay in my cage. Anything goes wrong. Mommy, bye. Yeah, and then I'll just be like, zoop, zoop, zoop. The problem is our barbarian, though. Ooh. You got a third character idea? Maybe no. an older sister who's like four? <coughs> no. Just kidding. But they're progressively getting smaller! Because Orion was like 16, this one's 13. Next one will be 10. No, no. Progresses by three years. So 10. What? No. Nine, wasn't it? No, what am I talking 16, about? 16, 13. 13, 13 minus 3. Oh. <laughs> Actually, if, if we were from the same family, it would be one of the parents, so take that. So the mom would be... So no, stop thinking about it! <laughs> the mom would be nine. <laughs> no, that's just... The that's dad wrong. would be ten, the mom would be nine. Cause that's oh, be I got... Uh, you know what? Let's <laughs> move on. This is going awkward. This is going to, like, child molestation <laughs> charges right All right, let's stop. <laughs> I know that's it does not. Like so what's the plan on approaching the city under stairs. siege? Okay. Uh, the, the stairs are on the other side of the canyon that, you know, that you're on, of course, because that's where the city is as well. Okay, then we walk around. It's about 70 miles. <laughs> but you can get, you can get, like, a decent distance away and then fly around and they probably won't notice you. Alright, then I'll do that. Yeah, okay. So yeah, you, uh, alright, uh, you all grab on and it's, it's a little harrowing just being that high up over the canyon. No, no. I flew up a 10,000 foot mountain, I think I'm okay. Oh yeah, you're fine. Oh, they're not. Okay. <laughs> well, I, you're we the one stood flying. on top of that. Uh, We're good. But ah, but that was a mountain. Now you're standing on a not so stable dragon woman. I'm sure I've done worse. <laughs> <before>. <laughs> Fair enough. 
I said the rule, bitch. What do you got on that? Yeah, you do. Uh, you I do make your way. Me. You do make your way across onto the other side of the of the canyon. I draw Titans, bitch. Cut one's head off. All right, so um, well, obviously the party order is probably gonna be me and Kira in the front, followed closely by Ray and Cage. Yes. Okay. So we're just walking our way down the stairs. All right, you start making your way down. Uh... Um, making your way down, you see at the bottom a, uh, a 40 foot tall, two story uh, gate made of bronze wood poles uh, bound with heavy chains. Mm -hmm. um, and there's a 60 foot tower with a battlement roof and many uh, loopholes uh, looking over it. Uh, they appear to be vacated. Well, I would that would be so. this structure here, right? Uh, it's, it's the little tower up on the top left there. Oh, this one right here, okay. Yeah. So, uh, the door is closed. Uh, the gate is the gate is closed here. Is there? Does it look like there's a way to open it? Um, can it be lifted, pushed open, destroyed? How many people so. here is weighing just you right now? Can you just fly to the top of the gate and peek over to see if you see anybody? I could try. Well, yeah. You want me to jump, fly over, and see? <laughs> I, th I think that's a good idea. I think not. I think I'm just going to destroy this door if Marcus says we can't open it. I think it. I see the I think we'll draw more attention other than just flying over the door. <laughs> I would I throw you over the door? I could do that there, too. Will you be there to catch me on the other side? Come on, Shindor. <laughs> <laughs> I told you that would work. <laughs> what are we, participating in the Olympic event wizard tossing? Well, now I'm just picturing, fuck this door, I'll open a dimension door on the door and just like hole through all of you through it, and then just like, whoop, <coughs> whoop, <coughs> whoop, <coughs> yeah, I'm sorry. Continue. All right. Well, uh, uh, you approach. Are you are you actually flying? Well, if we're over by the stairs and actually on somewhere we can land, then I'm gonna land in front of the actual gate, I guess. Okay. Well, yeah. You you uh, you land in front of the gate, and you hear uh, uh, you hear something being said in giant. Do you know giant? Anybody else know giant? I do. Okay. Okay. Uh, you basically hear from the tower, "Oh my God, it's back!" and uh, and there's a, and there's a scrabbling and let's see. You see about you see a bunch of giants just uh, just uh, peeking out from inside the tower, like holding rocks, like waving. Hi. They say something back. What's back? I don't know. You didn't mention. We're looking around, I don't see nothing back. That's not it. Oh, I think what is it? Us. Some sort of little dragon human. <laughs> it must be on their side. What should we do? I don't um, know. Can you so tell them that we're going to do that right now? So she's going to um, leave her weapon aside and she's going to walk up with her hand and she's going to be like, This one is not one of them. She says this in giant. Hmm. Uta da The fuck is banana? <laughs> She's what? ranting. Uta da banana. Ooh. Anyway, <laughs> They're like the Ewoks. They're like giant Ewoks. Just as hairy. Giants are now giant Ewoks. Do you think we're dumb? We're not going to trust you. You are Ewoks. Uh, I can get her through it if you'd like. How do you mean? Prove that she's not one of the dragons. I mean, she's not running at you guys right now, right? She might be sneaky. I've traveled with her this entire time. And yeah, just for your information, she's not very sneaky. She's pretty blunt. What do you want? They ask, what do we want? The heads on a pike. No, I was kidding. That would, just ruin, that would ruin everything. No, um. We are looking for a relic that just happened. Well, no, we know that. Um, How to word this? We're here to slay dragons. Well, you came at the right time. <laughs> yeah, pretty much, I just convey what. We saw saying. dragons. We want to fight dragons. Yeah, we're pretty much here for that. You're all we're... fools. But if it gets you away from us, fine. If it gets us away, you're gonna open your gates so we can come in. You're not likely to live for long anyway. Honestly, if they don't open the gate, I'll open it myself. Ah, uh, Arian said that wouldn't be protected. 
tell them what you said there. I will open this gate myself. I want to kill dragons. Yeah, Ooh. this one wants to kill dragons. It would be a wise idea to let her in before something bad happens. She's very passionate about it. I yeah, very passionate tent. indeed. I have the artel. <laughs> <laughs> open little gates for the little lady. Oh. Yeah. You be, you basically hear grunting and then like the, the gate opens up about five feet and they laugh a bit. <laughs> Only five feet? Arian waltz it through like it's a person. How high up can it go? Like twenty five. Can I grab it and push it up as hard as I can and see if I can shove it all the way up? Strength. Oh, and as Arian's walking in, um, she uh, thanks him very much and hmm. gets very nice. You're just like mm. and you'd walk under. Or like mm. <laughs> oh. I was hoping I'd be like twenty five feet. I suppose like five. <laughs> now I walk under. Okay. Do, do, do. You break the gate. Oh, why would you do? Rolling issue. No. Against a gate, it's landing on you. No. All right. All right. Now, see, if we dimension doored in, and they saw, it, they would really think we were spies. Then, my God, the dragons are teleporting. Oh. <laughs> Oh dear god, that would freak the crap out of them. That human's a spy. And look at the tentacled dwarf! They're after our bunnies! Mm. A dwarf and a dragon in cahoots, they must be after our cash. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much the two greediest creatures in the game. Oh yeah. <laughs> Aside from Mario. Mm. I'm not a dwarf! I'm not in the party right now. Kind There's of. still a creature out there to die. And I will kill myself. I'm gonna gain proficiency with a bow just so I can shoot her with her own bow. Like, <laughs> this is payback, bitch! Holy! <laughs> she will be evil. Hmm. <laughs> if you're sad with a pit fiend, you're an evil son bitch. Taste the holy power of your bow! I'm sure that's what you're going to do, my bow, let Arian do it, she will shoot Orion. Right! Yeah, but the thing is, is that Luciana would turn Arian into an arrow and shoot her at Orion. Because at this point in time, our social links are reverse cards. This isn't Disgaea because 3. Because family is... That's why I mentioned a Persona card and not Disgaea 3. <laughs> anyway, Marcus, we walk okay. into town. Uh, walking underneath, you guys can make a listen check. I have a good listen. Uh, 19. Okay. Listen, Listen would be seven, six. so twenty-three. Sixteen okay. for me. <clears throat> Twenty-six for me. Okay, uh, make another one. Everyone? Yep. Twenty-four. Twenty-three again. Twenty-four. That would be nineteen for me. Okay, uh, another one. That's a twenty. Uh, one so more. Eight plus six. I don't hear that last one. Or yeah, I rolled a ten for the last one. Okay. Let's see. You hear something about a hundred feet above you. It's like. Guys, flying overhead. You don't see anything. I can't see anything. I don't think we're indoors. I think we just went through no. a gate. I think oh, we're sure we're outside. Um. So we heard something a hundred feet above us, but we can't see anything. Or I can't see anything. Uh, if, do you inform the others? Of course I do. Uh, they can't see anything. Oh, frick. Okay. Hmm. Um. We're not shooting. I'm not gonna shoot you. <laughs> so I guess we continue walking. Okay. Do we just keep listening for something? I guess. Sure. Wait, okay. Um. No pun intended. I say we stay uh, close to where the buildings are. Just keep doing listen checks. I have an idea. <laughs> Yeah, 2 plus 7. <clears throat> I got 22. Cage, I think you got a decent listen, don't you? Yeah. And mostly comes from my wisdom. Yeah. Wow! Natural funny? 
Yep. Excellent. All right. You actually all hear it this time as it's kind of like a whoosh. Because it gets, it gets like a bit. It's yeah, it's close. How close are we talking? Uh, can we see it? Mm, you can't see it. You can it's practically invisible. feel the wind on your face, though. Um. Wait, so we can feel it, but we can't hear it? Jesus Christ. How, big how is far it? away are we? Are we still by the guard's tower? Uh, yeah, you're, you, you, you're, you're just a few steps into the guard's tower. Okay, right. so the, go, the, the uh, giants are still there. All right, I'm well, assuming if we get uh, can you guys set yourself rocks. up? I was about to say, can I do something to myself or no? Uh, just like you to, well, uh, yeah, the turn you hear, uh, the last, uh, this, the second last, the last one there. Okay. So there, I think it, there's Kami. Uh, I should be in there too. Okay. Oh, the spike one that I have is downstairs. Um. Because uh, I was going to cast a spell on myself. If that's the case, because I was going to get ready for something. Yeah, you can cast one. Okay, I cast blur. I cast. How many casts do we have? I think we get one or two rounds to do this. Do we get only one round to do this? Uh, yeah, because you just walked for the one round. All right. Um. What displacement? Whoa, 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 whoa. There's Ray. No, that's X. No, that's Caboose. I don't care. <laughs> that's a caster. Really. And now you need one more. Care for now, because okay. I actually have a pike, a uh, pub bird. Is that the order you guys are in? Yep. Okay. Call from eight seven seven eight eight nine two zero two four. It's a one eight hundred number. So hang up on it. Push the goddamn hang up button. Okay. <laughs> Done now. That Keep one doesn't back. work, I don't think. Yeah. Don't uh, mind. Help. It's me. Mm. No, I'm tempted. Turn around as soon as this thing comes down. Cast black light on its face. It's just like whoa! And crash into a wall. Mm. But that's how it works. It sticks it whatever the area is. It sticks it in complete darkness. So if I stick like a dragon's head in complete darkness, it's like what? And crash into a wall or something. Think about it. You hit it in the air. It's like I love how you do different voices. Like what? So part I enjoy about doing my some part I do enjoy about my campaign is doing the different voices for all the different people. Hello, hello. All right. Here's the edge of the of the yeah. keep you guys were just passing by. Uh, that's about it for important terrain in the area. Thankfully. Uh, There's a bill. Uh huh. Um, then all of a sudden, in front of you guys, uh, swoops down a green dragon. A nasty one. Starts about here. There be dragons. Yeah. And it fires its breath at you. Whoa. Who? Everyone? Uh, let me check here. Right. So I've decided... The spell I cast was Fuse Break. Okay. I cast Recitation. Half of Grace. Did you? Yes. So, what does that give us again? I always uh, forget because you've got like 40 different ones. Yeah, I know. Plus 2 to saves, plus 2 to hit. Plus 2 saves, plus 2 to hit. And if the dragon was in 60 feet of me when I casted it, that will be negative 2 to hit and negative 2 to saves for you. Mm -hmm. That's been awesome. Let me see. Okay, so plus 2 to hit. I'm double checking what I cast. Plus two weaknesses and what's rent is a sturgeon. Dude, you have no idea how awesome you just made my next power attack. Uh, you just got a plus twenty. Yeah, I totally know exactly how awesome I made. Plus twenty-two, man. I'm hitting at a plus fifty right now. Okay. Oh, frick. Power attack for all. Of oh yeah, I'm power attacking for all of my bonus. This is gonna be awesome. All right, you're all hit. It's a cone. Uh, you all have to make reflex saves. All right. Well, first, you have to see if you hit me. It's not for a cone. Not for a cone. Um, oh, right, thanks sure. to Cage's bonus, 
That 18. is 28. Plus 16. Plus 2. How much is that? 36. Okay. And everybody really else? What did you roll? No. Reflex. Reflex. Pay attention. I'm sorry. Do you have a plus 2? You have plus 2 to whatever you're rolling. That's a 26 for me. Because I'm a dwarf. And that was on a 2. You got a 20 that something on a 2. Yeah. Remember, pure, pure 18 is the super robe and being your favorite soul. Fro. This is why I. Too large. I've done all this to get my ref or my uh, saves up, and I'm still I'm, I'm by you, but not. Okay. I think everyone made it. I find it funny that two people got 20, like 27 and 28, because the DC is 29. Oh, you whore. <laughs> you know what? I I'm not even surprised. Wait, am I the only one who made it? Yes. Possibly. All right. Those of you who failed, take. A lot I of gotta things. stop making the. I gotta stop rolling these dice because they are a bit too good. Uh, I can take it. I can take it, dude. I've got a plenty I can of take it too. And cage with other. Oh yeah, barbarians can take it. Oh yeah, everyone That's has their entire uh, job. Everyone has twelve temp HP. Oh nice. Oh, Sorry, oh. I forgot about Diety's favor. Way too many buffs. That's what my character does. Well, thanks to you, I'm sitting at like two hundred and forty health. All right, 10, 20, 30, 30. Uh, 64 damage from this thing's breath. That is 17 d or 16 d6. All right, I'm good. And then initiative because uh, no, because it was a quicken breath, so apparently you can do other stuff. So it blows by, and it try and it makes a, it takes a bite at Kira. Okay, go ahead. I would take half that right, Marcus, so 34. Yes. Okay. I'll make sure I'm doing my math. Do we get DR on that or no? Um, oh, it's a bite. No. It's a natural attack. So the bite you win, not the breath. Okay. The breath was energy, and you have energy fire, not, not energy acid. Point, acid. Okay. Let me see here. Uh, by the way, the giants are like that's it. That's it. That's we'll, the one. We'll kill it. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. She conveys that. She'll be like, "Don't worry, we'll kill it." Half As face. said by the dragon that you didn't formally trust. Hmm. Half face. Oh, oh well, maybe not. 34, Kira. Uh, I think that might double-check. Have rod in hand. Out. I'm holding rod. I should hope so. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. Every time, man. You know what? That does hit. Okay. You rolled a two. <laughs> that son of a bitch can hit me on a two? Fuck, I'm killing him before he touches me. Dragon. Yeah. It's Remember, dirty. you got 10 off of whatever he rolls. Dragon's gonna drag. Hmm? Dragon's gonna drag. He hit you on a 2. That's why I'm going to kill him. Uh, you take uh, 24 damage from the bite. He then continues to fly. He's about 15 feet off the air as he's about here. And now you can roll initiative. Why am I sitting here? I should sit over here. Ah, I roll crap. Fourteen. Okay. I can reach him. Uh, you guys can make a religion check on this dragon, actually. Okay. That's an odd check for dragons. Fourteen. Oh, uh, Kira, are you good? Great No, are you? Are you? Is your line good? Yes. You take an extra twenty damage. Ooh! Wow, that's intense. Thank God I'm evil. Don't worry, they can only do that once a day. Oh. Uh, my initiative is marked by 20. Okay. 37 for my, uh, oh. for my, uh, check. The religion on it. Oh. Uh, it's, it is a knowledge. fiendish green dragon. Fiendish. Oh, okay. So. Yeah, that fiend. Okay, so. Uh, sorry, I gotta hear your initiatives again. 14. All right. All right, Kira, what's your modifier for the 20? Plus what? You have a plus nine initiative? Holy shit. <laughs> How the hell did that happen with this character? <laughs> I, I had a higher initiative. 20, but I've only got a 5 to it, so I'll go after her. Okay. 1, 20. 25. Here are also okay, 20. Gage gets 25. What does this cost? I forget. And. Did you know what music you want? I'm assuming you'll be using my laptop. Probably not very good. 13. Okay. 
No, I, just, I go before it. I go one before it. Okay, do you have anything that can knock it to the ground or at least bring it closer? No, I do not. All right, well, I guess I'm I got to charge. Not a force match. I guess I got to charge it then. I may nuke it and heal it and kill it with harm. Gage, you go first, and you have music. Yes. Oh, I really want you to. I really want to get that. Uh, where, where did that dragon rider go, Gage? The huge size one. Uh, downstairs. Oh, that was close. I swiped my hand over this. <laughs> <laughs> And then I and then I looked at it up and I thought my hand was just stuck to it and then I was like, wait, that's a bunch of needles. <laughs> yes, the ninja has needles. Let's leave that out, how about? <laughs> Not on the floor, because someone can step on that. Put it up there. Or Fine. just give it to me. Give, give it to me. me. Okay. Yes, throw the needles. Oh, um, they're not that big. They're in a safe thingy, sort of. Which is not for me. I'm fine. <laughs> I'm not bleeding or anything. Not... Seriously, we haven't needed a huge dragon forever, and now that we need one... Well, that, I took it out because we haven't used it, and now it's like... I thought you brought up a whole bunch of dragons every day for once. They're all medium They're all here, they're all large. Mm. I needed a medium size. Okay. What do you do, Cage? Okay, so for my action, I am just going to... Turn out just a bit. It's kind of a bit louder than your voice, actually. Sorry. Okay, never mind. I didn't... <laughs> Random. I forgot what the waves. That's for the uh, another one. There. Um, for my action, I will standard action cast darts of life and yes. How and many do you get to throw? I get to throw two on the first turn. Because okay. I'm a healing ninja. After that you. is Kira. Uh, sorry. I'm just gonna Kira. How much damage did you take? Altogether, 98. Yeah, I'm going to throw two darts at you. So I'm running 111 health. You have 199 health normally. Oh no, 100 and, or uh, 200, 201. 200, right, whatever. So you get 15 temp <laughs> HP, uh, you heal, tw and then you heal 26. Okay, I'm sorry, 15 temp? And you get 26 regular death. Two rolls. Six? Three and three. It's all, all my yeah. healing comes from my feet. Really does. So which one's my mini on there? Uh, yours is the one with the scythe. <clears throat> I don't know if you can reach him, especially considering he's in the air. Alright. Give me the bow! Actually. No. She'll give it back after the battle. We're in the yeah. middle of a dragon fight. Nope. <laughs> nope. It's a dragon. I can use more. What kind of an action would I have to use to throw the bow? Standard. Then fuck that. How I'm not spending a standard action to give you a bow on your turn. Can I move over, grab it from Luciana, for next turn? Yeah, you can. All right. Would that work? Go for I, it. Take it. Perfect. That's done. And that's what. That, that's the reason I said no. I didn't want to give it and lose a standard action. I've got a plus oh. fifty to hit this thing, and I'm not charging. Uh, yeah, right I guess now. you just. What was that only a five foot? Yeah, can I uh, you're, you are willingly, you have like the bow out. Yeah, it's you, on my back. Okay. So you're just you can just take it, yeah. So can I uh, take it then move a few squares back? Yeah, uh, sure. Okay, okay, I'm going to take it then move. Uh... Okay. Alright, after Akira is Owen. Charge it. You do have cage in your way. Not if I'm flying. I have this for my If he's in the air, then I'm in the air. I am. Straight line, however, uh, he's 15 feet up, and I think Cage's head will still be. I use Cage's head as a prop and jump off of it. No offense. I'm four. What's feet your speed? Wait, he's four feet tall. Fuck that. He's oh a dwarf. yeah. Okay. He's a dwarf. I guess you can charge. All right. Uh, he will get the AOO on you. Okay. Well, then go for it because that gives me the option to use my uh, breath as well. So now I can use a breath without having to worry about an AOO. Excellent. Extra. Are you Thirty-eight. Thirty-eight? Yeah, that hits. You're only adding to the inevitable by adding plus five more to my damage. This feels so much like Yu-Gi-Oh that whenever he does something to me, I just keep getting bonuses. By the way, Cage, you're probably going to need to heal me next. 
Yeah, I know. I just ran out. Uh, 27 there. damage. 27 damage? Yep. Okay, one second. Um, oh, no, no. Oh, I'm at 150. Exactly. Wait, no, I'm not. Which I take less because of the DR. So I'm actually at 1. Alright. So that was physical damage, right? First things first. I'm going to use the quickened lightning breath. Just because. Um, we already used his AOL, so there's no real point in letting him go with it. Because that's because of two dragon Oh, I see. Hmm? Returning classes, new classes, downloadable classes. This guy has four. No. Oh, I'll show you. Hmm? Sorry, I got a lot of dice. Mm -hmm. I'm a medic. <laughs> I'm used to sitting on the ground. So, they are. so when I'm up here. Get. No, I don't I got very good change for it. Okay. Every time I've ever rolled on that thing, I get boned. I gotta roll it on a flat yeah, surface. So, first things first, just gonna take the breath attack. I think that's 37 damage. Uh, he has to make a reflex save of uh, at least 27. Okay. Uh... He doesn't make it. Then he takes 37 lightning damage. Okay. And now I will make my attack at full power attack. So I am... So here for this guy, I'm over halfway to my next level of mage. That looks like mage. Okay, 450. Okay, or was it 37? I don't want to see uh, Kira, yeah. I'd like you to look at my dice for a second, please. That's actually, yeah. That's a natural 17. So, uh, that is 17... Uh, does a 59 hit it? Yeah. And I shall roll to confirm. That's the power attack? Oh, yeah. I'm hitting at a plus 55 right now, my friend. I told you I cast two strike on myself before. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> okay, um, so I confirm no matter what happens. One hundred and sixty four damage. Okay. Boosh. How much damage did you do? One hundred and sixty four. On a charge. Wow, that's actually impressive. Well, I full power attack. After Owen is first. Ray. Kill it with lightning. Use a super big lightning bolt, and I'll be immune. I will aim a uh, empowered fireball above, so it'll hit, not hit Owen, but just hit the dragon. I will do. You're being nice. It's green, right? Aren't you? Yes. It's, it's gonna have fire damage. damage. Oh wait, no, you can have. You can buy a party member. I know it's funny. You have the resist fire anyways. I could technically hit you. I don't want to. I don't want to waste all the one fifty fire on just you though. Yeah. If we fight a red dragon, I want to make sure I'm safe. Yeah, so I'll aim at that since I'm assuming he's big enough that I can aim it without hitting him. Uh, yeah. I will do fire and should I do lightning or cold? No. Huh? Oh, lightning. Do lightning. Cause I'm lightning. Immune. So in the off chance it's, it does hit me, then I'm immune. Okay, do uh one twenty two fire lightning will. It's not in power then. It's maximized, right? Yeah. Sorry. I'm using the feet though. So I'm maximized. Okay. Uh, make I'm a maximized. caster level check. Oh, lovely. That will be a 16 plus 2, so 18 plus, um, cash level 16, so 34. Okay, you're good. And that was how much? It will be 122. Okay. Mm. Alright. After that is Necrozite. The dragon's name is Necrozite? Yep. yep. Oh, how, what, did, what did we get on the religion check? Uh, I got a 34, and Marcus just said it was a fiendish green dragon. Mm -hmm. But we couldn't discern any... Nothing really special, apparently. It's a regular dragon! Mm -hmm. 
Well, no, it's a fiendish dragon. Yeah, no, That's but... why it had smite good against Kira. Mm. Yeah, I was like, that sounds like smite. I have smite dragon. <laughs> oh. It's my dragon against Dragons. dragon. <laughs> Go, Dr. Hercules, smite. And that you hate dragons, so who smite? Who smite your dragon? I will devour your soul. Think, think, think. So what does this dragon do? It will. He follows to the fields. What's its speed? Only hundred and fifty. Only. It's a lot of fun again. <laughs> well, he just got smacked by Owen oh, in the yeah. butt, and he was flying away. Hey, man, if I'm given a round to cast two strike, I'm going to use it next turn. Yeah, because if he does fly far enough away from you, you can't hit him. Man, what's a final of 59? It goes 300 feet. It goes around the corner here. Those giants must be like, oh my god! Yeah. After that is Cage. Heal me. Jesus, please. Yes, I am Jesus, thank you. Um, am I going to dart my way? I am spending my full round of toss, 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 toss. How many darts? Uh, that's eight darts throwing, so I'm going to heal and catch everyone up on healing. Uh, how many hits did you take on? A lot. I'm at 166. 73. Princess. Out of, 137. Out of 97. Okay, Ray gets a single dart. Yeah, all I need is one dart. No. Oh yeah, because he made the save. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so you get healed. 18 and have 15 temp HP. Oh. Oh, okay. And then How many are you throwing at me? I am throwing four at you. Blah. So... Twenty-eight and a nice. That's three and one more. Forty, fifty-two healed, and you have uh, fifteen temp HP. And oh, nice. Kira. And I'm gonna chug a potion so I can get the rest of that because that's only like five health. And you said fifteen temp HP. Two. Yes. Okay, sweet. So, Kira, you heal 26 and have So, that run HP. away from us? It would appear that way. And then I throw the last. I eat the last one. So, I heal 12 and have 15 temp HP. Alright. After Cage is Kira. Uh, your barbarian can move 40, right? Mm -hmm. Your barbarian can move 40? Yes. Plus the bow. Yeah. Um, I don't know if you can shoot 300 feet, though. Plus three no, yeah, you totally, totally can. Uh, long bow. The Just bow can shoot 300 feet? It's a so long bow. It has a range increment of 110. And oh, with shit, range, sorry. With range, yeah, and she takes like an 8 of... I'll say if you move like way over here, you can see the dragon around the corner. That works. So you can make one shot at it. Yeah, that makes sense. A barbarian shot? Wow. Get my plus on that. Okay. I challenge you, grapple me! And you do have a plus two to hit, is it? Yep. Plus two to hit. Plus two to full save. Thank you for that, Cage. I have a plus 55 thanks to you. You're welcome. And then for both I deck. Yes. Mm. Dex to hit only. No damage. Yeah. Yeah. yeah your, well, you had part of your strength your damage because it's because of how yeah, com yeah, it's how composite it is. How composite are you? Okay. Composite mm. <laughs> <laughs> That didn't work. Out of curiosity, how does the dragon look, by the way? Not good. Oh yes. Does it thirty hit? Ah. Oh. I don't think full retreat takes away from No, it AC. doesn't. Full retreat's the no. one thing that doesn't. Full yeah. retreat is the same. Uh, what'd you difference. roll for that? Um, I roll AC. 
I would almost suggest taking a fake Oh wait, one. no, sorry, it would be a 31. I thought I had the plus that was on the bow. It's only a plus one? No, my uh, collision pops that one bow was a plus three. Yep. Oh wait, no, then it was a 30, 30, 30, 33. Ooh. And this thing's evil, right? Yeah. Give her yeah. add 2d6 for the you, uh, uh, 33 hits. Good, 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 good. Wow, we might kill this thing right it now. It had two health left. <laughs> oh, that's right. oh, okay. oh, yeah, I got it right. Yeah. Automatic damage, collision, plus yeah. eight. Plus eight, yep. I don't even need to roll damage. You're just like, you run all the way over. You're like... <laughs> now... And it just nailed him right in the neck, and he, so, went, and he went falling off. With the religion check, did we find out anything useful about this dragon? Like, was he a... What, was what kind of deeds he did? Uh, no, you, uh, the religion check was just to figure out if it was, uh, uh like... Like why it why it was particularly spiky and mean looking. Oh, that's it. Okay. Yeah, I was from. So, but it had a name. It did. Its name is Necrozite. So does that have no significance at all, or? Mm, not really. Oh, uh, okay. Just something. Well. Uh. Like, did did Tiamat send him or something, or? No, uh, actually, it might be a girl. I don't know. I don't care. That'd be freaking hilarious. It's like it Tiamat's like, yeah, I don't want you guys here anymore. I'm just gonna fucking send this stuff. I hate dragons. I hate, I hate giants. Fuck giants. Which? Oh, by the way, were we able to see the color of the two dragons that looked weird? Diamond die? Oh, die. Um, well, this was one of them. It was flying. It, or actually, yeah, it was flying around and then disappeared. It has a ring of visibility. <laughs> oh. Wait, we killed one of the weird dragons. Wow, fuck that. I want to go charge the other one then. Two striking the next generation. Well, I'm wondering what that the giants are saying since we actually killed the dragon. Yeah, what are the giants saying? Don't say anything. They saw us kill a dragon, and now they're not saying anything? They're probably... I think they're probably feeling bad about not trusting us. Oh, like that. I almost want to relay a message up there, like, Yeah! Yeah, how many dragons have you killed today? Yeah. None. Couple. Rock! <laughs> oh, There's a couple. Be so <laughs> really? Gross. What color was it? Hmm? For me and Owen, Imaginary? So close. <laughs> kill, steal. So close, I know. It was terrible. Huh. Orange stole items, my character steals kills. That's funny, right? You're you and I are the most deadly combination this group has, man. Hmm? We sneak him to keep us alive. Oh, yeah. And if, if Cage is beside <laughs> it touching it, then oh. Cage, Cage, what do you bring to this party? I'm an armored fortress that dispenses up healing of great justice. So you're, a you king, you're, you're a king heal slime. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I would appreciate that. I love how slimes. <laughs> Excellent. Uh, also, as you, um, you know, as, as you finish the thing off and it goes, like, just falling off, uh, you hear from behind you guys, it's like, Well done! Do you remember me? Who's that? You turn around. It's the ominous fabler, Zeech's fool. Mm. Oh, fuck. Okay. What are you doing here? He's, uh, he's in, um, armor and stuff, also. Me? Yes. Ah. Uh, I don't know. Hang on. <laughs> <laughs> well, that seems like an excellent reason to be here. Oh, I use talking stones to get myself. <laughs> yeah. I don't know why I'm here. Just give me one moment to look at the. Excuse me. Sorry. I've got a feeling that I've got a feeling I'm here for a reason. I just don't know what that reason is yet. The script. One moment. <laughs> one moment, please. Who's that line? Right here. Would it make it easier if one of us just killed him before he got the chance to talk, or is he useful? He's useful. Okay. He's not really useful. For us, or... Hey, he, he, I thought he was kind of cool and slightly entertaining at the dinner table. Oh, that guy. Are you staying in the air or are you coming to fly down? Or oh, I came no. back. I came back. Yeah. People had barred off with him. Turned you to see, after I hit him and he ran like a bitch, I was like, I can't catch that. I can't move that fast. But then when I see a holy arrow shoot by and hit him in the face, and I'm like, okay, I'm coming back. I didn't mean to confirm that thing's dead. I know the power of that bow. It took down a lich. And by that time, I had a guy who owned the hand of Vecna. And it also took down... Well, you didn't see that. But no, you did but I got, I see the Urgle stuff. No, you didn't see the Urgle stuff either. No, I did Fuck! Oh, Eden did, not this one, yeah. Again, stories that she's heard from both people. She's heard about... The bow does lots. Yes. I love that bow. And by the way, your character's totally a beast master right now. God. Just without the... Yes. Oh, okay, here we go. <laughs> well, it's amazing, actually. 
Well, you see. You had caught my eye during Zeech's ball. You. Oh, that guy. Yeah. Right there. She knows of him. Oh. Oh, no, it's, it's, it's Zeech's, uh... Again, it's Zeech's, character uh, wasn't yeah, there, though. Okay. Yeah. Character wasn't there, but she has alternate past memories. Anyway, <laughs> continue. Uh, so I decided, uh, probably for my own safety as well, to abandon Prince Zeech. He is not very happy right now. But what do I care? I'm free. <laughs> so so I've been searching you out because I want to write poems and epic stories about your progress in this world. It's quite heroic what you're doing, you know. I want somebody to rule a sense motive. I don't know if he's spying on us or if that's actually truth. I came prepared for this. Thirty-four. Yeah, you much much better than me. Well, because he's got religion, I've been taking ranks out of religion and putting them into sense mode. Because I've got like forty in religion right now. It's insane. Well, where else do you put it? Oh, actually, I've got a pretty good intimidate right now. Prime face. Yeah, I've got a, I've got a twenty in my intimidate. I know. Prime face. So that's I have it. Mm. Oh, and I have an eighteen and putting one rank in it. I put seventeen. But did you calculate your synergies? What do you mean? All the skills have synergies. If you have so many ranks of this, you get a bonus to this. I didn't know that. Yeah. Not many people do unless you read the player's handbook one fully. I yeah. go by synergies off of Kira's old character sheet. Your original Wah. character sheet put it on the list of synergies. You gotta help me with that, because I might have higher in stuff then. Not yeah. a whole lot for the knowledge. Just what would I have higher in then? Because uh, I know my bluff got me higher in my diplomacy. Your intimidate might add to your diplomacy. Eh. It does them, right, Sergeant? Either way, I got a 20 intimidating me. I'm mm. intimidating. Okay, he, um, he he appears to be legit. He okay. seems interested in your uh, in uh, sharing your story with the world. Are you sure you're going to be safe coming with us? Oh, of course not. I oh. plan to be kept a little bit away from the action, if you don't mind. If I were to die, then my story could not reach the world. Problem is, how far back are you planning on staying? Because as you just saw, a dragon can go 300 feet. So? Okay. It's your... It's, you, know, you know what? It's your neck. I'm good. I'm I, feel, I feel safe in your presence. I'm gonna keep walking. This guy's creepy. Luciana's gone. Follow if you want. I'm out of here. I'll be sure to try and keep an eye on you. Peace out! <laughs> yeah, you, you guys are peace out. I'm just like... Bleh, bleh. Let's just stop doing the... Bleh, bleh. Oh, okay. he, do, he does it when he wants to. <laughs> because I, I miss He's that. He's silly like that. I miss that. Um, I like that. Pretty much Aaron's like, yeah, I'll keep an eye on you and... Well, Excellent then. Uh, he also um, the mage is just like fuck these places. Let's see. Uh, la, 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 la. Oh, I, I I don't want you to be uh, intimidated by this, but uh, <clears throat> uh, he uh, he suddenly he transforms and he becomes uh, he becomes a uh, large size. Uh, pretty much just a large size version of himself. A larger lover! Which is a yeah. somewhat sinister looking gnome like humanoid with a prodigious nose, beady eyes, and pointed ears. Uh, he's like, oh, You see, this is a power that Spriggans have. Not even Prince Zeech knew that I was one. I decided to keep small to keep a low profile, but I think being big might be better in this situation. Wouldn't that mean you would get spotted? Everyone would think he's a dragon. Or not a dragon, but uh, a giant. You see, it has already gone. I'm sorry, I already said she walked away, so I'm not saying anything. Well, I do have connections in this town. I used to, uh, I used to be uh, an ad an advisor to a stone giant thane that uh, that used to rule this area. Uh, just a, a ward. Uh, he had a uh, he had a horrible vision of the uh, of the age of worms coming to pass, and he sent me out into the world to seek it, and uh, and do something about it, I suppose. So then. Um, well, my travels got me to Prince Zeech, and we're walking as he's saying this. Okay, good. I was going to say, if you guys are standing still, I'm, like, already halfway up the city. <laughs> and he, uh, and, well, I, I ended up getting caught in Zeech's palace, you see. And he, uh, well, I was going to die. I was definitely going to be executed, but then I decided to put on a little performance. Uh, it's a good thing that I was actually a fool to the thing as well. And uh, Zeech found me amusing, so he decided to keep me alive. Now I'm out. He's unhappy, but, well, 
what can be done. Um, was he unhappy for other reasons, or...? Uh, he's always unhappy for some reasons. Yeah, he's not I believe Lashona went missing before that. He's not happy about that either. Here's Perk out. Do you know about what happened with her? Uh, the last I spoke to her, hmm. He says at the party I'm punching him through a wall. No, it was probably been shortly after the information was released. Maybe. But if he still says that the last time he talked to her was at the ball, I'm punching him through a wall. Just because it rhymes. Ball of the wall. If he says the last time I was at the ball, then I'll fucking punch him through a wall. <laughs> Bob-boos! Gagoosh. I made himself a bigger target now. Oh, yes. There's no chance I'm missing him. True strike. Bob-boos! Bob-boos! So, uh, let's see, there is... I can't remember the Count of the Dragon. Um, Two unknowns. There's like... Oh, well, we killed one. Dead, there's like a dozen black... Half a dozen big blue ones. No, there's like... Five or six blue ones. Five or six blue ones, like half a dozen green, and a dozen black or something like that. There were more black than there were green, and there were only a few blue because they were bigger. Yeah. Unfortunately, Lashona had very little use for me. I was seeking out the Age of Worms, but she didn't seem interested in my help. You guys didn't talk much. Not a whole lot, but I learned one or two things. Probably nothing that you don't already know. Uh, Might as well say them, just in case. Well, there's the whole Dragotha matter. Mm. Yeah. I believe these dragons are here on his behalf. Did we know that? We sh Yeah, we do know that. Okay. We know that Dragotha is looking for his phylactery, and we just told them, Hey, you can totally find it now. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So of course, like a good villain, Dragotha sent all of pretty much all of his best minions over to uh, to take it, but not himself. Oh, of course, <laughs> like yeah. a good villain, dragons are there. The <laughs> 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 well, question becomes: Are we just going to keep trying to find this black here, or are we going to try to organize a defense of the giants? They have the giants are that friendly. Oh, exactly. They opened it up because they wanted to see us get eaten. Fuck that. I'm going to look for the black ring. Okay. I can't see, so I need someone with eyes to help me. Okay, uh, where do you guys travel to? Well, since you're walking ahead of the entire party. Only by a bit. I'm still within listening distance. Yeah. Just ahead. Draw a path for yourselves. So my question though, Mark, is what is this big long? Uh, that appears to be a canal. Uh, it's, it's, uh, I think it's an aqueduct. Okay, so that's a bridge. Yeah, that is a bridge. So you take a long way around or walk across the bridge. So I guess we walk across the bridge. Do, do, do. Hey, I thought across the bridge. Why? So I don't have to walk. Oh, I thought it was like a small bridge that we might have to be worried about doing. No, no, it's a it's it's a giant sized bridge. Oh, fair <laughs> enough then. Fuck that. Okay, well, right, so if I, I was a phylactery, where would I be on this map? If I were a phylactery, <laughs> where would I be in a mountain, in a tower, somewhere slightly a bit obvious? But can we use great. can we use um detect Water. magic to find the biggest source of magic? Wait, wait, don't you describe? I can't. I do have this uh this certain object. Or certain location. location. Yeah. Because I, yeah, I did pick it up because I was like, well, I got to learn spells for level six, eight, yeah, anyways. Uh, yeah, the certain location is level eight. Level of course, wandering around, you're seeing, uh, you're seeing the occasional catapult bolt being fired or crossbows, dragons breathing fire here and there. Uh, none of them seem to have gotten close enough to you to worry about, though. Yeah, we we'll just continue along. We're like, we're going to find a phylactery. In fact, this one we fell like at the same time. Dragons of giants, like ah, we're too small for them to notice. We're like, yeah. do, 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 do. Cage is like, I'm invisible. <laughs> I'm only four feet tall. <laughs> Am I four feet tall? You just see this massive arm, just ching, 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 happy face. Like a bite size, like mini bite. Yeah, but I'll get stuck in your teeth. I ain't ever seen a blacksmith get so angry until the moment uh, Tentacles walked into that door and said, "I want this armor made for me in this size." He ain't never made armor that small before. <laughs> That that thick that. What about the halflings, sir? The halflings what never. The that? halflings never wore a fucking full plate that were that loaded down. That's true. He had to make a wall of steel and wrap it around your body. That's uh, the side. Yeah, the. Uh, let's see. Uh, the cistern way on the way on the side there, the little circle on the on the right is um, 
it's 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 pretty deep. It's full of water. Uh, the the actual aqueduct running underneath is probably only about five feet of water, and uh, it's not ro running very fast. So you don't really have to worry about falling, and then getting swept away. The water's really nice. It's really pure and clean. Uh, besides that, there's not much to say about this area except for you know a few dead giants. We loot them. Just kidding. The dragons did it first. Oh, <laughs> those <laughs> bastards! They rival even us in thievery and bastardism. Uh, I guess just we continue along. Hey, okay, uh, where do you head? Uh, I asked the party to stop and be like, discern location. What are you discerning? Um, go to the Yeah. Here we go to Uh that is divination magic? Uh oh you know what it's probably got like a block against it. Oh Pointus is probably No, so think about it. If Dragotha think about it. If Dragotha could do that if Dragotha's level we think knowledge back into the world though. Nothing short of mind blank but spell or direct intervention of a deity keeps you from learning the exact location of a single individual or object. Certain location circumvents normal means of protection from scrying or location. The spell reveals the name or creature of the object, uh, community, country, uh, continent, blah, planet, distance where the target lies. Find a creature with the spell, must have seen the, the creature, or has some item that once belonged to it to find an object you must have touched. Oh, I can't use it because I need to touch it at least once. Oh, okay. So fuck it. Never mind. I don't think it would have worked anyway because if it's a phylactery like that that um, they're trying to keep hidden, then they would try to hide it from Dragotha who probably just, have that spell. They, we just got rid of Mind Blank. Mind Blank and di uh, Deity Intervention is the only thing that stops a certain location. Stops the spell from seeing it. You might have something that stops you from casting it in the first place. Mm. Like a giant like golden hand that appears in the sky and slaps him in the face as he tries to cast it. This isn't Bigby's giant crushing palm nor crushing, crushing fist of spike. You're right, it's Mordenkind. <laughs> Mordenkind does build shit. He doesn't... He has a hand technique. Why are there the two uh, maps, by the way? Sorry? Why are there the two maps? Uh, the two... Oh, uh, the... Um, the smaller map is actually... Uh, That's where it is. <laughs> no, no, the smaller oh, map is one level blue. down. Mm. So there's an under... Right there's, there's quite literally an undercity. Uh... Okay, it, so it's underneath the diamond-shaped uh, tower. That's what the outcropping there on the, hmm. on the map is. A diamond-shaped tower that goes underground and has its own mini-map. I wonder where that could lead. Yeah, because we have so three totally islands connected by bridges map. and one with the tower. So are you heading... Uh, uh, which way are you the heading? The tower in? we have to fly to. I want to see the map, actually. I haven't seen the map. Just one second. For fun. A few of the map. Well, you've seen that you you know all the stuff. I didn't put the landmarks down, obviously. Oh, where wherever you guys want to go, I'm good to go. Watch on the map where you want to go, and we'll go there. Okay, so we went up the stairs, got past the guard gates. The uh, long we thing is the bridge. Yes, we went across the bridge. No, we went. That's the aqueduct of the bridge. Oh. You just cross there. Then you close the stop. Oh, okay. So... Well, mm -hmm. there by the three oval things. Sure, things. Okay, so we can either go into the main city and look around there. Um... Who are the first little island? I turn to the... Uh... What the... No, oh, uh, uh, Spriggan. Yeah, actually, he'll tell you his name if you care. I do care. Uh, okay. Tentacles cares. I'm like someone. Vote. Are you right? Uh, in ball. case you do care, my name is Gazelfec. Gazelfec. I'm gonna call you Filch too. Okay. It's a pleasure to meet. Very well, Lulu. Oh, them side words, bro. <laughs> <laughs> it's a pleasure to meet you, sir. Unless you have to tell you. your nickname was Lulu. I'll kill you too. You saw what I did to a dragon. I'll do it to you. <laughs> Missed 99 you. health. Well, I'm your physician. I got out of your physician. You look. Yay. You got it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Run! Run! Yay! You're like, yay! Oh. Hey. Oh. oh. 
Anyways, um, I asked Spring, what are some major locations here in the city that he knows of? Oh, well, it's quite a it's quite a grand place, as, as you already know. Uh, Wait, this guy knows his way around? Fuck it, he's he our tour worked guide. here. He's our tour guide, man. Exactly. The, the, the city you see on the on the left uh, to the left, as you can see, if you look at out your left side window, uh, is is actually just mostly um, ruins and dragon corpses. <laughs> currently, <laughs> well, now, uh, but it is mostly residential. Uh, so I doubt there's any artifacts inside. Aw, giant children. They're out of it. They're almost as big as me. <laughs> they are big as me. Now the formerly grand tower to our right is the uh, flat is uh, Flat Rock Pinnacle. Ah. Uh, as you can see, it is uh, connected to our city by a swaying bridge of wooden chains. Ah. Uh, it did hold catapult and ballista emplacements that were quite nice, but uh, apparently it, it has all been destroyed at this point. Uh, I'm not sure if you'd be able to find anything there either, but uh, there's some very interesting ammunition that they use here. Uh, it's called carrion crawler loads. Basically what this, what this dwarf does is he has a big farm of carrion crawlers in the bottom, uh, on the, in the lower city. He takes them, he cuts their heads off, and he distills their brain juice into what is basically a catapult ball ammunition that allows for very effective, paralyzing catapult shots. Uh, an excellent anti-dragon measure. <coughs> okay. <coughs> Was that you coughing or the character coughing? That's probably me. Oh, are you okay? Yeah. Give me a second. Uh... uh can you throw it? <laughs> you pick it up, give it a oh. I was going to say, why don't we just like, pick up a couple and roll them down a hill and see if we can. Well, no, no, I just mean like a dragon comes, you make a throw anything check. The other defenses of this city are uh, the guy lines that you see hanging from the cliff. And you do see a bunch of like long chains that are painted to be the same color as the, as the cliff face. Oh, yeah. See, those are meant to snag the dragon's wings and, and hurt them. Uh, there's also ballistas in the area. Uh, some of them are just normal. And some of them are attached to chains, which, by extension, are attached to rocks at the top. And if a dragon tries to pull away from one, the rock comes off. And then the dragon and the rock fall to the bottom of the Rift Canyon. It's quite clever. You really miss this place, don't you? Oh, it was a wonderful place. And uh, its defenses are, of course, being put to the test right now, aren't they? Yes. Um, okay, so beyond the residential district, what is there? Here, let me think. That happens to be a live dragon! Well, we can do that too, but... Hell, we just killed one of the weird ones in one round. We can kill all the other ones too. Well, I, I don't I, want to test for a lot. See, see... I, I wish to break another black dragon's skull. And I, I'm tempted one to... One on one, we're good. The problem is oh. that will be one on one. I, I'm tempted to go to Flat Rock Chronicle, but there's almost no reason for us to go there. <laughs> I thought the fact that it's got a name. Well, I think that we should maybe stop off there at some point or another. Maybe not now, but maybe later. So we can yeah. take up some of those balls and throw them at people. I, I don't know. I think it's going to... Hey, look, it's drinking. Like Pearl Lords. <laughs> got the balls? Luciana, ready? <laughs> yeah! Balls! Do you use true strike so I can throw it properly? Oh, God. True strike. Ready? Plus 20. <laughs> Now you see far, far down, I think you can see it. It's a little circular keep that, that's, uh, that's basically in the middle between the two halves of the city. Well, okay. uh, that is called the Round House, and it is, a, uh, it is a well fortified tower. It appears to be not doing too badly against the dragons currently. Round House, I'm just picturing somebody kicking somebody else in the face. <laughs> uh, it, has a, it has a moderate amount of siege emplacements. Um, Oh, I'm getting out ahead of myself. You're looking for places that would have, that would have, possibly the Drago, uh, the phylactery of Dragotha, correct? Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, if I had to make a decision. Well, uh, the main palace, of course, would be a uh, would be a good place to start. Uh, that's all the way in the southern end. You can't see it from here. Okay, then we'll let, let's start there. So, place we should just work our way through the mines of Moria. I mean. <laughs> So well, wait, we're going to pass through the... We're, we're not going to go into the residential district. We'll check out the Flat Rock Pinnacle later. 
I will pass by the roundhouse. Kick. Um. <laughs> roundhouse. Uh, are you guys keeping near the buildings or staying out in the in the clearing? Probably uh, near to the buildings. Yeah. Smart way is clearing, keeping near the bu- buildings. Attracting dragons and killing them is walking mm-hmm. around like a fool. Okay. So you're just making your way straight south. Yeah, we're just gonna keep, uh, you know, working our way along the cliff face, working like through, through uh, buildings and whatnot, just keeping. Yeah, trying to keep ourselves out of the out of the open. Let the uh, dragons and the giants beat the shit out of each other. Mm, okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, you make it about uh, uh, halfway to the roundhouse when uh, you get spotted by some by some dragons. It's it's a group of the smaller ones. Uh, uh, I shall take them. How long have they been? Time wise. Huh. Um, walking and talking probably about... We're probably running short on those. Yeah, probably about 45 minutes well, already. Okay. Two of us are an entire day. Mine's long, then it's 45 minutes. So we are roughly where the X is. Alright, sounds good. Okay. I'll let you stay in charge of the map, thanks, I don't know. Well, I mean, I'm just keeping track of relatively our position and everything of note. Sorry. I just want to double check how long this plays my last. I've never cast it. This is the first time Of course, all these buildings are oversized and have huge doors. Some rocks around here as well. Doors. Lots and lots of doors. You have to play it since off with stone skins. Hold on. Uh, excuse me. Stone skins out. Walking down across the buildings. Yeah. Uh, you here first, I'm guessing? Yeah. I'm assuming so, yeah. Mm-hmm. Is it a 10 minute level? Which way are we going to go that way? Yeah. 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 Where's the Spriggan? Hmm? Oh, alright. He's, uh, he's huge, isn't he? He's large. Large. Good to use in That is awesome that that's him. Wee! <laughs> <laughs> is he that far away? Uh, he's keeping a distance. That is awesome! Like, when, when, you're, when, you're, when you're traveling across, he's just like, <laughs> da da da. <laughs> <laughs> by, the, by the way, Mark, it's, I have to say something awesome about that mini. What? Someone took uh, Photoshop that mini doing all the Olympic events. <laughs> so there's like swimming, <laughs> it's like reaching for a tango to another one that's <laughs> reaching off. <laughs> it's running as fast as a canyon during the race. <laughs> like bowling and stuff. No, it is. Yeah, really <laughs> bowling would work, yeah. 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 <laughs> Let's see. Uh. So, uh, four black dragons and a green dragon approach, you guys. How big are they? They are all... Oh, wait. Uh, the black dragons are large, the green dragon is huge. That is pretty easy. Ray, we killed four of those dragons before. The, the black dragons that size? We killed four. We no, they were small. Or they were uh, large. Oh. They were mean. Super me dragon! You've got spells that nuke things. <laughs> We did also, yeah, we had Aki, Garrett, and... A dragon for each of us! I'll take the big one! Rah! I'll just be in here. Give my portion for this. Do they land, or are they going to fly around like bitches? Uh, they're, um... we got to see what their... typical tactics are. Okay. <laughs> Breathe lots of shit. No <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, I guess it's all acid. We want to have fun times with that, too. Not in the drug farm. Do we get around to the bus before they attack? I don't think so. Do we? Hmm? Do we get around to do something before they attack or no? Uh, yeah, you'll have a round as you're, you're probably keeping an eye out. Yeah, okay. Yeah. All things considered. Protection for energy acid. See, so yeah, I'll let you... What uh, do you think? Protection for energy acid. Protection from energy acid. I can't stop myself. Recitation. Is that the same thing you did last time? Yeah. No. Okay, good. I'm not. Plus you in 10, 12, 10 HP you got. Well, I already got 15 temp HP from the last time I gave it to you. Uh, well, temp HP yeah. wears off. Okay, so then it's plus 12 temp HP, okay. Okay. Wears off in uh, 16 minutes. Okay. 
and I resist mm -hmm. acid. Do you move at all? Um. They're over there. Uh, that's where they end up when the initiative is going to be rolled. Sorry, it, I cast resist acid on myself, not protecting from energy. <laughs> oh, Behind right. Rock. There's a difference between the two. Right, right, right. Uh, where did Cage move? Back, Back behind the rock. <laughs> Put me beside Cage. <laughs> it's a one person rock. <laughs> Finally. One person rock. <laughs> I You're both, I, both the casters oh, no, are I'm like, oh god. <laughs> I was gonna say, what are you doing here? You have 40 whatever, whatever AC. I was gonna say like right here. Uh, 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 that I can uh, still see and Cage just like, be. reach around and tap. <laughs> Uh, so I'll. Wait, uh, we can't move any. Can we move any closer to them if we want? You can. Yeah, you can put yourself. You can move yourself uh, a bit closer. Let me see. Hmm. Rod in hand. I'm trying to think, figure out what I want to do. What do you want to do? What are you doing? You're just gonna stand there. What are you gonna do? Move in that kind of nothing. You guys are gonna hide behind. Ooh, there's a Here's giant wall that one. protects us from breath attacks. Are you serious? Kind of. All right. Okay. How high are these rocks, by the way? Uh, they're uh, between like five and eight feet. Chest high wall. This makes a sense for us because we're made that this. Works yeah. Because if they all breath weapon, they'll just be hiding behind a rock. Because we're between a rock and there, they can't reach us. I know, but it makes sense for two milliers to be hiding. DR doesn't work against acid. You have resist acid now. Yes, and the last thing you used acid on is did 60 damage. The resist I have on is only 20. 150 fire for both of us, but... It's acid that it uses. Like, I know. For both of them. One, the one's black, one's green. They both use acid and poison. Okay. Uh, so you guys can roll initiatives for yourselves. No, not 20. Yeah. 23. Green got 19. Tentacles got his foot stuck in a rock. Black's got like three. Oh, wait, wait. 22. 18. Okay. Arms on 22. I'm sorry. Uh, the way the maze look, it looks like the springing is running to get behind the rocks. <laughs> oh, my oh, my God, guys. Maze. Excellent. The bra brave adventurers are about. What are you doing behind those rocks? <laughs> Oh, wait, wait. Do you want me to write poems about you hiding behind rocks as dragons approach? Do you want to melt by dragons before they get... Get back here! <laughs> okay, uh, so you got 22. What do you get? 18. Right, 18. What do you get? 9. Okay. I will just drop this one out. And right? No, not 20. Okay. That's actually kind of amazing. Oh, and you first. Uh, yeah, you can't charge him. What's the spriggan go on? Oh, uh, let's see. He's a, he's like a roguish, bardish person, so. I have an idea. So he's probably actually got a behind initiative. Oh, yeah, yeah. 22. He's got plus 11. What do you got? Plus 5, so he beats me. Okay. Okay, <laughs> I have an idea. Ray? He, uh, I want a new gum. Oh, fine. Uh, what he does, he... Like a bastard. No, no. He uses. Uh, I was gonna say do the switch. Okay, thing, he's he's a he's a level two bard. Hooray! He uh he does uh he does inspiring song thingy. So you got plus one to uh, hit and damage. Oh, <gasps> yeah. yeah. Plus one to hit and damage. Yes. All stats. He plays his little pan pipes. The problem is even even if I switch you, you're only so gonna get. So he's providing music. The problem is even if I switch you. I guess he is, isn't he? Yeah. All uh, you do is charge. You won't get a full. No, no, that's what I was going to say. It's on his turn. I didn't think he was going to stand there. Because I was going to say, try and convince him to walk up to them. And then if you switch places with us, then I can get a full attack on one and cleave into another. Well, can you convince him to walk up? He already cast something on him. I don't know if he can... Can he still move? Standard. He can still move. Hey, you! Walk up to the closest dragon. I'd prefer not to. I can tell you, you and I will be switching spots quite soon. Uh, uh, diplomacy. <laughs> Diplomacy. Not very good. Uh, Plus five, so twenty-one. 
Closer. No. <laughs> well, then get away from it, because if you're only going to go that far, you're useless to me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, seriously, if he's not going to go all the way, then I don't want to charge it. Yeah. Hey, come on. Your your turn. Holding my action until you're done. I just right. got music. Actually, yeah, I got music. Fuck that. I am going to lob a fire lightning ball in the middle of them. They're close enough right. to be able to hit all three. I give Ray my turn. She gets to use two fire balls. <laughs> Good problem. Oh, yeah. Like these three? Yeah. All right, you okay. win. Fuck okay. it. Well, he's got the bar, so it's like, randomly he plays this on the pan pipe. Do yeah. I need to make a... Do I need for the person that scores it? Uh, oh, yeah, I think they have score resistance. All right. Why do you make three or just one? Uh, three. All right. Oh, oh okay. First one's a natural 19. Okay. That's one of them. Nat 20. You have to fail pretty bad to not hit these black dragons, I'll tell you that much. Uh, 13 plus 2 plus... You probably made it. 16? 31. Yeah, 31. Oh, okay. Yeah, you're good. Alright. Uh, what's the, um, what was it again? Uh, fire and lightning. Fire and lightning? Uh, 122. Okay. Uh, look here. What is your... Antacid... Oh, sure maybe they don't have... No, I guess they don't. Okay. They're going to have acid, I'm going acid. Yeah, okay. Uh, fire and lightning, then. Uh, yeah. What's the save? It would be 16, 18... Or no. 20, 10, 21, 23... 30. 30? Okay. 30 reflex. What is your reflex for guys? Oh, you didn't hit the big guy? You only the little guy? Like these three, I think she said. Oh. Oh, I meant it one of the big guys. There's only one big guy. There's like, oh, you were hitting these three guys. I kind of lower to the time. Okay. Three, and mine is three actions versus... Still hitting three out of the four. No. <laughs> then call me, you're going to be by the first one probably have to hate. With Owen does something epic. Ah, oh, there we go. Uh, you said it was what, 30? 30. Okay. One makes it. One doesn't, one doesn't. They have plus 10. One of them rolled at 20. Okay, so one takes uh, 61, and then the other take 123. Two. What's the damage? 122. Oh, okay. Right. There we go. After Owen is Ray. Right, so I cast the fireball. Nice, Ray, it's your turn. <laughs> Owen right. decided to wait to after me. Why don't you get Dimension Door? Because then I don't get to use an action. In fact, I'm probably just going to cast So, it. you're going now? No. Alright, fine. Uh, next is the green dragon, it looks like. He will... And the fly has a head to it. The heck is there? Oh, there we go. Yeah. Um, Alright, he's about, uh, yeah, about 40 feet off the ground. He flies overhead. Uh, he breathes down on, uh, uh, Kami, Ray, and, uh, and Luciana. So, uh, oh, I think only you have, don't have the resistance. Yeah. Right. Okay. Do you have to uh, Yeah, uh, well, no, you don't have to because you're resistance, right? Yes. Actually, how much is the resistance? 30, because of my level. Oh, okay, yeah, you still might have to because it's, it's quite a few d6. Well, and mine's only 20, so. So, reflexes. Is it the 32. same type of dragon? Uh, yeah, they're both, they were both green. That's a 41. 41? No. Oh. Yep. Uh, Cage, you cast your shit again? Yep. Yeah. 8, 9, 10, 11, 27. Okay, let's say one. 34, actually. Got your two. Hmm? Got your two. Oh, just your three. Hopefully. Hmm. Hoping, 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 hoping. 
This sounds like a lot of D20s. Uh, the save was 25. Made it. Everyone made it. Huh. Yeah. And I've got to put the song on YouTube repeat. Yeah, it's huh? It is from Soul Calibur 2. I knew it. Is the theme of the place with the ship. Yes. Cervantes? Yeah. So, well, yeah, pretty much Cervantes is level. How much damage? The damage is... Epic, apparently. Yeah, two with spawn. Forty two altogether, so it'll be twenty one for those who made the save and one damage. You take one damage. <laughs> oh! 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 My oh that one point. And I guess and I guess you took twenty one, right, because you yeah. made the save. Okay. Uh, and and uh, also the green dragon. Actually, you take. You have still 10 HP. Yes, so I'm only erasing one of the 10 HP. Yeah. Alright, wait. Oh, yeah. Uh, I see you have eight, 19 or less HD. The green dragon's like, what? And you all have to make wolf saves. How far away is he from us? Um, uh, he's 40 feet away. Okay. Is, do I have to make a wolf save higher than 33? No, why? Plus my goal right now is 31 plus 2 minus 33. Force persuasion. You will, atta- you will have to make a... You will have to not roll a 1, then. Uh, I don't roll a 1. Okay. I think I'm okay. I got a pretty decent will. Okay. What is it? Uh, 18 plus 13. Okay. Oh, yay. That was Oh, you make it too. Okay, you uh, you are not frightened by this guy. <laughs> He's like what? I'm like no, no, no. Now I take my turn. Okay. And now I go up and I'm attack this motherfucker. Okay. He uh, he won't make a zaylor. He won't. No. He chooses not to. He is smart face. What if I decide to use my breath weapon? He's trying to make a good example for these guys. Well, if you try to make use your breath weapon, then yes, he will. But he knows what you are. Okay, good. Then I use my breath weapon. Okay. Then he makes a AOS. Do it. Do it. <laughs> or not immediately, but... I just realized that I had one. Um, 35. 35 to hit? Yeah. Then you hit. Okay. Oh, nice. Yeah. Uh, that's also going to be 31 damage to him. Okay. Uh, he has to make a yeah, reflex save of something. Okay. Uh, the damage that he does to you then is. Every cheese is horrible at the same time. 15. 15? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. 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 And let's see. What was that? It was just awful. Here. The tree. Not 18. The character put the tree on the tree. Uh, I the think, yeah, he makes a save, so. So he takes half, so he takes 15 lightning okay. damage. Okay. Just that I cut my half on me. You hit me. Um. So. Where did you learn to do, or where did you look up to do the tree? I do he does oh, have blur on, so that is uh, oh, that, that I think well, is a twenty percent mischance. Yeah. So okay. you roll a d10 and uh, the two numbers, I guess. Yeah. Uh, one and two. Okay. Oh, that's a two, I think. Yeah, that's a two. So I miss. Yeah. Motherfucker. All right. Yeah. Okay. After Owen is Kira. And I'm starting to think that your berserker is going to have more use of this bow than than Orion did in the entire campaign. Uh, well, that guy just flew over your head, and there's these guys here. Choose your. Which one? Okay, uh, he is in melee, and do you have any uh, bow feats? You don't have feats like your Orion does. So shoot something else. Fair enough. I'll these guys, I think, are in your first range increment, so you can fire at them. I'll be hitting. The uh, brown. Okay. Yeah, brown. Brown mini. The brown mini is a brown dragon. Wow. Is enough. it? Yeah. <laughs> I think it's a copper, isn't it? No. Brown dragons no, are more. 
Brown. Jesus. Yeah. Yeah. They're, they're made of sand. Oh. That's that why it's not made of sand. 13 plus. It is made of blackness. Death. It is made of blackness and swampiness. And death. And death. 48 hit? Um. Yeah, probably. Uh, yeah, probably. I hope so. Oh, yeah, yeah. They're just. Okay, and this they're they're evil. CR9 dragons. This thing evil. <laughs> Uh, yeah. Good. Fun fact about 3.5. Most all dragons are evil as can be. All no, dragons. half of the dragons are evil as yeah, can be. Yeah, the chromatic dragons. Yeah. The metallic dragons are nice. Yeah. Like me. You're not a metallic. Yeah, one sec. Yeah, I am. Oh, yeah, you are. All right, then I'm not. I'm blue dragon now all of a sudden. Oh. I'll accept that. It was better with my alignment. The dragons are ugly. Fuck you. I like dragon. Blue Dragon said the illusionary I'm in the desert brand than a Tesla coil. I thought it was a brass dragon, something like that. The people remember you get the two D six on top of it. Mm-hmm. Bang. Yeah, it's just a dragon. Yeah. I'm assuming you took some arrows from her too. Yeah, I did. Yeah. I took the whole thing and Uh well you have more than one shot. Don't you? You have your full attack? Ooh. Pew pew. Yeah. But it was twenty seven so far? Twenty seven, Ray. Yeah, twenty seven. Um, what do you need her for? Scanning. Yeah, yeah. scanning. So. Um. All right. Nine plus twenty-five. Uh, 34. yeah, that that'll that'll totally do it. I'll do it. Nine plus twenty-five. Yeah, thirty-four. Chris, you might just be making me want to play Soul Calibur right now. Do I have it? In the corner. Far corner. No, not that corner. Far corner. Ah, okay. Plus another 31 mm. damage. Alright, that one actually goes down. Yeah! Dang! You got oh. two dragon kills so far. <laughs> Double kill! You got all the dragon kills so far. <laughs> I, I like that. Don't look at me like that. I'm smiling. I don't have anything wrong with it. No, you look stern like, I should have all the dragon kills. No, I have I the, should have all the, the cookies, cookies in the cookie I jar. I have the only titan kill in this campaign so far. I'm happy you know, with it. There's one only one titan. titan. Exactly, I win. <laughs> In fact, I, I think that's the only time unless you get one. It's in. like I killed the Mewtwo and she's killing off the Zapdos and stuff like that. There's three legendary birds and there's only one Mewtwo. What's what's Greg Oak with then? Uh Lugia. God tier. Lugia. <laughs> Fuck that. There's another Pokemon thingy out there that's like pure god now. It's the thing that can take any tile and become any type. Uh that Arceus is or something like that. Uh, Arceus. 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 Arceus, that's the one. That's Dragotha. I guess. Alright, whose turn is it now? Mewtwo will always be my favorite though. Oh I like Mewtwo. Yeah, whose turn? Um, she's only done two attacks. I believe barbarians at that level will get. Is she level sixteen or fifteen? Fifteen. So she'll have three. She doesn't know this stuff. She's new hmm. to barbarian. All right. So what's the plus to her hit then? Oh, well, it's uh quite a bit because she's a barbarian. Yeah. Plus fifteen, plus ten, plus five. So it'll be a plus five. So for both plus three, so she'll be hitting with a plus eight. Plus her dex. So plus five, plus five, plus. Five. Three, so we're so getting a plus thirteen. Okay. Uh, that probably won't hit. What is it? Uh, it was a twenty-four. Not quite. Didn't think so. So anyway, next turn. All right. Uh, well, it's too dawn. After Kira is Cage. The man needs a turn. <laughs> As like, hmm, what do I do? Uh, no one's really injured at all. All so he did was eat away the temp HP that you gave me, so I'm good. I'm going to five foot and fire sh- uh, Yeah, if I fire sh- I can hit everyone because I can- Helm's orbital laser! But you can hit the big guy too? Uh, I can put at like 32 cubes within 300 and- No, Dude. 450 feet. Dude, put a lot by this guy, that's awesome. No, no, they don't stack. Oh. Yeah, you that, That's the trick, is they don't stack. Because if you did, it's like- should we go with the fight? It takes 162 D6. D6. <laughs> of fire damage, though, on a red dragon. I have an energy sure. substitution. Yeah, you could energy substitute. It could be holy ice or holy acid or something. <laughs> well, you can make it holy? No. Oh. oh. Unless you're good. Oh, you're not good. Yeah, then I just cast it. Uh, I'd have to cast it as a little mine, and then it does half of its damage is unresistible. You should become good. Tentacles is playing super healer, so very well in his alignment, kind of. Anyway, yeah, as long as they lawful. Undo. I've been playing by the rules so far, so. Dig, 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 dig. So yeah, and then the rest you just. 
I don't know. Yeah. Um, now, if you can get holy, that's DR unstoppable, man. I'd go good for just for that. Breaking through all kinds of DR. Oh, that sucks. Uh, tell me what the reflex is. Uh, reflex is... Oh, first guy. Uh, four is four. Twenty-three. Mine isn't awesome, but great. Okay. Is this a will save or a reflex? Reflex. Oh, okay. Even half damage on this fucker will help me. How many are on this thing? Uh, I only need to put one cube on him. Oh. And, and the it covers an area based on the cubes, oh, I but see. it only does like it basically is a tar is the targeting for it. Oh, I see. Okay, I just got a message, a thing from Ray. Probably the pictures that she's scanning. Maybe she's scanning the pictures now. Scanning yeah. the pictures. Yep. Reflexes. What was it? Twenty three. Twenty three. Okay. I think we all. Have um, all right. The green makes it. The black. There are three of them. Have you made it back to the yet? Mm. Not yet. We're just finishing up pages. Okay. Done. Hey, Scan and send to Marcus and Kara. Sweet. One makes it. Send it to me. One does not make it. One makes it. So this, or yeah, this is the one that doesn't make it. Send these to make it. Yeah, I just and what about the big guy? He made one as well. Okay, so... That is oh, and I guess oh, roll four uh, cast a level right. checks and don't Please. get below... Thank you. Like, 19 or something. I appreciate it. Why do you want to copy? Because I have a D&D uh, folder. That's like 20 people 19. That we in it. Uh, I'll... That's a... 30... That we got and stuff? 30... And 32. Okay. And you have... And what was that? One of them was 19, you said? Or one of, one of them was was uh no it was over nineteen oh. when you told me that so uh it was oh, yeah. I, I, twenty six you, you definitely punched through the Done. black dragons and probably the greens as soon as I can see it because you know how the three point five monster manual has the dragons all squished up together yeah, I don't know. yeah. um presence like blah blah, blah. Yeah, water breathing hey. I don't know why green dragons breathe underwater. Marcus I thought that was the black dragon's thing. Uh, both green and black are swamps. Where is she? Oh. Oh. But black are the... Breathe acid on you, leave you for days to rot. Then eat your body. Mm. Leave you in the fridge. And by fridge, I mean burning flesh. I like this new set of dice. Master, you made through. <laughs> All right. Uh, so how much was it? Fifty-three damage. So how many of them are dead? Uh, okay. So fifty-three. Um, oh yeah. Well, that one. And then I think the other one now. Because that one took one twenty-two as well. So fifty-three. Yeah. Double kill. Let's see. So those two both didn't make it. So it's fifty-three on this guy. And then the green and, guy. And uh, he took the one. Oh no, wait. Oh sorry. No. This. You're right. This guy made the save. That guy didn't. Okay. So that is 22. Yeah, and so the other one didn't make their save. Or no, 26. No. Uh, and, sorry, that one made it, so he's at uh, 87, uh, and this guy's uh, dead. <laughs> okay, so one left because it And then control. this guy, uh, you hit him, he was at 15, so now he's at 31. There we go. Okay. Good. I feel productive. Well, he's more than no, 41. 41. Yeah. There we go. All right. All right. After Cage Dra is the black dragons. The two of them. They feel them. Hey, Cage, the brave enough to challenge you? I will go. You're like, no. That's not bravery, but the constitution. I just don't like all <laughs> I fucking hate all It's more the, like, I don't know. I just... Yeah. I only green all of them, I can't block. I don't oh, touch. Okay, these two will swoop down, breathe their acidy breath. Do it. At uh, both of you. Yeah. Wow, I like how they're just ignoring the huge guy in the corner. Because we just neutral their friends. 
Oh. Yeah, he's not doing anything. He's just playing music. Okay. Uh, so I need uh, two reflex saves from Ray and Cage. Uh. Thirty-two. Uh, and that'll be thirty. Thirty-two and thirty-two. Okay, so. I only have a no, wait. Okay. I'm gonna still take yeah, a lot of damage. Have to hit Ray, you pretty much just resist everything then, I think. You're gonna take half, then minus 30 off of it. This is why I like what I purchased the other day. The worst I have such a high reflex is what I was able to purchase. No, that. No, no, resist increases your saves. Okay, when I this you're taking four. Oh, resistance in four. Okay, uh, the first one does one 18, so the right last at it. Oh, first one does 18, so I guess that's 9 to you. Yep. The second one does... This is why it's nice having your own item compendium. You can spend the time with the items at first. But, helping up your character. I'm still hittable, but... 21. So Ray laughs at that too. And you took 10 minutes. Okay, after that is. Spriggan. Spriggan. He's still playing. After that, he's actually like, he's like kind of like backed into the corner now. <laughs> and after that is Ray. Ray. Aim for the green. Yeah. He's a big, big guy. He's a little guy again. Okay. Oh, okay. We only well, have to you're worry about one. No, 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 it's fine. No, go for it. You take the two little ones out. Yeah, it's a good idea. All right, uh, we have to pierce them through again, right? Sorry? We pierce through again, right? Yep. Yes. Yeah. Or, well, no, two. There's Just tell me what you roll, Ray. Five. Five, so wait. Five to seven, twenty-one. Twenty-three. Thank you, Ray, Carrie. You're missing your two. That one I have no clue. What the? That would be a reroll. I'll grab my dice and set it. I'm gonna grab a different one. That would be a natural 19. Sweet. All right. So you get the you get by the two black dragons. I'm gonna buy with a five. Huh? I'm gonna get by with a five. Well, I guess I'm blessed with the two is not. Yeah. If they're dead, they're dead. Right. Oh yeah. And it's what 122. Because I got rid of one dragon feet. The what? I replaced one of my dragon feet. Train them. Oh, right. Oh, right. That's what got me confused. Okay. Yeah. And, you what, and the save look. is 30, you said? Yeah. Okay. You're giving me a look like I <laughs> One makes it that. again, not 20. Not 20. And then one doesn't. Uh. So which order no. did you do them in? 100 and. Uh, I guess the one that, that made it last time first, and then the other one. So this is the one that made it last time. So you made it twice now. Uh, yep. They both made it's it last time. No, so which one? Yeah, those two are the ones that made it last time. So which one made The only one made it last time. So yeah. The black one was the one that made it last time, meaning he's the one who took the 25, meaning the green one who's got 87 didn't make it. It doesn't 50. matter. Yes, it does. No, it doesn't. It really doesn't. This one's 122. They're both going to die pretty young now. Also, none of them are at 100. Well, okay, well, yeah, one of them is 120 damage. Um, let's see. 122, so 61. Because the same one made the save both times. One's now taking 160. 120. 120. 122 so by half. 149 on that one, and then 122 on the other. They're still alive, but not very. So one has taken two full 120. Mm -hmm. Remember last no, time one I took three 25. Of them. The black one's taken 25. Yeah. You gotta remember last my first turn I hit all three of them. Two didn't save, one saved. Yeah. Yeah. So. And so then they the got black one saved. The black one I'm, saved. I'm just saying that the one that saved first is going to is saved again because it's funny that he got two net twenties. Okay, okay, so, so then the, the second one, one is taken yeah, over two hundred so damage. So you need to watch. So the black one saved the first time and took twenty five damage, meaning this time around he took half. No, no, that's that was against cages. Yes. So he saved last time and took twenty five damage. He saved against cage. He saved against Ray twice. Yes. So the guy who took twenty five damage is the one who's taking the save damage. The green one who didn't save this time around takes the full one twenty two. After taking the 87. So 87 plus 122. Plus 122. Oh, wait, hang on. Because uh, you're adding 122 randomly. That means there's an enemy on it that shouldn't be there. Because the uh, big guy is that one. Oh, okay. So you're right. taking 122 from me twice. Yeah. Because th this one saved from Ray the first time. Oh, I guess I wrote something down wrong. Okay, I guess the other guy's dead. Yeah. And the other guy took 25 plus half of this one right now. And 25 plus 120. No, half of 122. You saved my 122 twice, though. Yep. That's yeah. So, this guy's 122 plus 25. So, 147. 
The black guy was the one who never took your hit the first time. No. He never took the hit the first time. The other one's dead. I hit yeah. the three little ones the first time. Yes, and, and there were four one. little ones. This fourth little one didn't get hit by your attack. This guy's only taken 25 damage plus the 61 now. Alright. That's what I'm saying. So he's taken 61 plus 25. I know. Both of you. Whatever. Nah. Whatever Keep going. Keep, Keep, going. Going. Keep a number. Keep going. It's the fucking green dragon's turn, so it's Marcus's turn. Oh, yeah, because you waited after. Yeah, I did. I didn't think the fucking thing had blur cast on him, though. I would have hit him with a crit. Okay, uh, well, you hit, you hit everything with a crit. I rolled yeah. 18. Sure, so anyway, uh, after that is. The green dragon. Yeah. Alright, he turns around. Okay. Is he nobbing on a win? Yeah. Um, no, no, no. No, no, no. Alright. I'm sorry, I'm just imagining the squeaker toy now. Is it like, nah, nah. Oh, that'd be Garrett's squeaker toy. Oh, God. <laughs> you know, the one that every time he does, he does his dwarf mating toy. No! No, I'm a dwarf and I'm disgraced by that. Alright, so the bite misses. First claw. I'm dwarf. Mm. 24, that'll miss. Second claw, that's a miss. First swing, 34. On the dot? Yeah. Second wing misses, and tail misses. Hmm. So just one wing. Queen. Alright, that is. 9. I take 9. Yeah. Right. So now it's my turn. Yeah. Full attack. Okay. And thanks to your plus 2 and. Yeah, so that is going to be plus, plus three to your base. Okay, uh, 13 plus 32, that'll hit. Next attack, 14 plus 28, that'll hit. Uh, that might not, one second. Will a 32 hit him? Um... Yes. Okay. So after this, if we... Hundred and sixty nine damage. Uh, okay. <clears throat> there we go. Alright, after Owen is Kira. Alright. More <laughs> and now for some more chaos and with the butter. Rogue. Without taking the um, from where you are, there is a rock in the way. Yeah, I okay. And you can take a single shot. Right you, you don't have skirmish or anything like that. Sadly. 35? That hits. That's your phone. It is. Oh, you rolled really well with this bow. <laughs> 28 damage. I think that your barbarian's chosen weapon is this bow, and Orion picked up the wrong weapon as a child. <laughs> <laughs> Orion was supposed to be an axe the entire yeah. time? Well, no, because remember when Orion had the sword, like the, the long sword that was uh, axiomatic, she did more damage with it than she ever did with the bow. And then this character is supposed to be a barbarian berserker, or I'm a smack you with an axe, just kicking ass with a bow from afar. <laughs> All right, but after Kira I remember, I, I am thinking the fighter from the uh, Sacred Stones. Oh, yeah. Like, mm -hmm. just as, like, a massive sword. Mm -hmm. After, uh, after Cage is, or no, sorry, after Kira's Cage. Sweet. Um, I got the big one. 
Yeah, yeah, no, I am good. Um I challenge him. Make him grapple me. I dare uh, you. I am ungrappleable. <laughs> Don't say that. No, I mean it. I can't be grappled now. <laughs> no, no, if I someone hits you to grapple you, then you can't be grappled. Why are you ungrappleable? If somebody attempts to grapple me, I automatically get an attack of opportunity. If I hit that person, then I get to add the damage that I do to my uh, grapple modifier, right. which is a 29. And I get an automatic 32 to my damage. So 29 plus 32 plus whatever I roll on my 48. Yeah. Never challenge a DM by saying you're uh, untouchable. Yeah. Oh, let them learn. Your DM will, will find a way to nuke you. Well, if, a, if a nat 20 gives you only 20, I'm good. But a nat 20 gives you 30. That could be funny. Anyways, um, we're still waiting for this. Yeah, so, yeah, I'm still waiting for my turn. I don't even know what to do because no one's even injured at all. Then just attack the dragon. I uh, I don't want to spend firestone on that. Then walk up and poke it. It won't even hit you. In the sky, they're both in the sky. Is it in the sky? Uh, it's only about five feet above the ground right now. They they came in pretty close, so they could hit you both. Mm. So you'd just be taking a negative two for getting that out of the thing, right? You know what? I'm I'm just my heart. Okay, after cages, uh... I'm just gonna save all my souls for later. Fair enough, Black Dragon. That's true, I should start doing that too. So you already... He thinks, you've been, he yeah, thinks that you've been cowed by his magnificence, so he... Five of sword and attacks. Yeah. Well, I'm actually... I am a magnificent! I'm taking my maximum. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, maximum is gonna find me. Well... Let's see how many 20s he can get. Oh, yes. Wait, is he seriously batting at me? Yeah, he is. Wing. Wing. Dale. Nothing. Tink, 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 tink! After that is... Spriggan. He's like, oh, this will make an excellent tail. <laughs> You're from the army? Uh, Ray, then. Yeah, that is Ray, yep. Yeah. Like I said, I got the big guy. How much damage is this one taken? The one in front of you? Yeah, how does he look? Uh, pretty bad. You can do a regular fireball then. Okay. I'm gonna pull a little bit of DC6 Magic missile! Beep, beep, beep! Chaos! Wait, magic, words like completely magic missile automatically breaks through spell resistance, doesn't it? Yes. Wait, yeah. how many magic missiles can you do? Four. Or five. Plus one. one D4 plus one. Oh, it's only plus one? Yeah. Oh, never mind. Then. There's a higher mm -hmm. level version that she's like ten of them. Oh, oh really? Mm -hmm. Oh, he doesn't make the save that time. How much damage do you do? Okay, roll it. Uh, oh, and, and don't roll a zero, or don't roll a one with your spell. Cast a little check. Oh. Natural 18. Okay. Oh, sure, yeah. Because there's two nibs of balancing every day. Six. Six. So 12, 17, 18. 20. 32, 34, 33, 35 damage. He goes down. After that is... Yes, the green dragon. Is he going to try again? You can make an AOO. He's buggering off. Really? We have another one running from us now? Mm-hmm. Okay. Dragons are smarter than other people. They know if they're, they're in, the, in the fight where, you know, most of their buddies are dead and uh, they can't hit this one guy. Um, they're probably not going to win. Mo and most black dragons just breathe acid on you and bugger off into the night and wait till you get weak again. These black ones wanted to impress uh, their the peers, one? pretty much. Uh, 57 damage. 57? Okay. Is uh, this one named two? He resists that pain, and he what? makes it 600 feet away. Well, he only took 130 at that point. Can I still see him? Uh, he's 600 feet away, but yes. How much I damage was it? Uh, 57. Okay. I can technically still see him, if I can still hit him. I don't know if I want to random fireball that far. Do it! Ooh, only level place, three. Yeah. Got lots of level fours, fives, and six burns. Uh, how did he look? Because that was the damage that I did to him. 
Oh, right, it's 195, so 450. Okay, actually, he did die. Okay. Boosh! Okay. Either way, we're going to nuke him from... Uh, either way, he was going to die. There we go. No, <laughs> That battle's over. It looks no, like the... the uh, it looks like they're not going to try and bug you, uh, at least for a while now. Or they're just... They just, they're just ignoring you. Wow. You know what? Now I just want to just fly up in the air and see how many dragons we can tempt. Um, considering There's half a there dozen were. pretty fair-sized blue dragons, you know. If you yeah. But not to their other attack. DR10! It's really helpful to have, seriously. I know. I have stone skin. I know how useful <clears throat> it can be. Remember All the right. displacer beast fight. It's true. Mm -hmm. But we're pretty much done here. Do you guys want to move on? Yeah, continue well, searching for the last week. They attack us, they attack us, but... Yeah. We have more important they things to worry about than them. Yeah. Uh, your... And we just killed two groups of them. Two oh. green dragons solo and then... Well, we killed... Two green dragons, four, four black. We, till, we killed two... Uh, no, the black, the black dragon community must really be. Well, no kidding. <laughs> we killed... Eden killed one, and then we killed its children, and then we just killed four more. So we killed eight black dragons so far. Is that four kids? No. Four yeah, kids. there were three kids. There was the mother, <laughs> and there was the four that we fought. So there's four kids. Three kids. Marcus, was it three kids or four kids? Can't remember. I think it was three. Mm. Either way, we've killed ten dragons so far. Okay. You leaving? Mm hmm. It's only ten o'clock. It's ten thirty, bro. It's ten seventeen. My clock is ten minutes past. It's for one waking me up. Ah, okay. Mm. Okay. Has she earned the bow yet? Uh, Luciana doesn't care anymore. She'll take it back if she needs to later. After I, after she saw that spectacle. Uh, it's not so much a matter of being impressed; it's a matter of trust. Oh yeah, she trusts me, but then no. <laughs> she's giving you rope in which to hang yourself. What? Basically, she's telling her to go hang herself with a bowstring after she's done killing everything else. Okay. Okay. Garrett right now is the one that's pro your character. You gotta win. You gotta win. And the problem up. is, right now, half your party is taking those stances. You got betrayed by your sister and the demon pulling around your sister. You have the same curse as your sister, so the demon's probably pulling you around, too. So, unfortunately, actually, guilty by association. Actually, the sister's tree is the curse. But we, we don't, don't know, know that. that. All we know is that right. she's some 13-year-old girl who says she's that she's the, older. Like she still has the, she's older but looks younger, which is what Which Orion is the exact has. same curse, so everybody in the party is assuming Casey's just like the other sister who betrayed us and was working for the pit fiend. How yeah. do we know this isn't the same? So, until which such a time that we see Which is why we like with the person, but we can't trust your character. Character, yet. exactly. No, I totally understand. So, the character must suffer. Yeah. I forgot to go. So, unfortunately, that is the logic that goes behind this. So. The hand effect and thing that The logic happened. that goes behind it. I know, don't worry about if it. If the Hand of Vecna thing never happened, we would have been like, no, but the Hand of Vecna, no! We lost, oh, we lost Orion. And a relic? I know, I'm Jeez. concerned about Orion, but the relic's, you know, important. The case. I was about to say, wouldn't it be funny if we sold the boat? <laughs> whoa, whoa. We could have made a lot off of it, though. I know. That would have been fun. Wait, 30000 for this bow? Hell yeah! But still, it's, ma it's making it work. Hell yeah, it is. Everything we're fighting is evil. It gets an automatic 2d6 against it. It's beautiful. Yeah. I think it gets an additional by plus 2 if it's evil. I mean, undead. So it's like 46 against undead. Mm -hmm. Why do I come out of here? Let me have... Nope, it's okay. I'm leaving those two. Oh, okay. We'll have just throwing. I have other ones I can bring later. Oh, okay. Alright, all three of them scan... Or, this is scan, sends all three of you. It's all <sighs> Okay. Yeah. Okay, well, see you guys. Goodbye. Yep. Oh no, the DM um, game. What about Saturday? We're doing it here, right? Yep, yeah, and we're doing mine, so bring your Pathfinder stuff. I have it with me right now, anyway. Okay, good. Alright. Uh, so, you make it, uh,
the rest of the way to the roundhouse without uh, without incident, just because of you know ducking and dodging and sort of thing. Uh, let's see. It's a heavily fortified tower that rises to a height of 60 feet. It is outfitted with two ballistae and one catapult. Um, it appears to have been targeted a few times by the dragons, but it remains undamaged for the most part. I guess we knock on the door. <laughs> Wait, so are you playing Kira's character? She didn't leave her character sheet, so I mm-hmm. can't. So but she can still do talking. True. She just can't do battle. Let's see. Won't be long for myself. I got work tomorrow, so. Yeah, I gotta get up early. Well. So I think we'll be going for maybe what? Half an hour. Yeah, sounds good. Probably should end it early because it is only three of us now. Yep. So we'll do mm-hmm. one more thing and then probably head her. Mm-hmm. Sounds like a plan. Mm-hmm. We got a lot done today, so. Oh yeah, we did. Let's see. Six um, dragons. Six dragons. Got through the gate. Then we're gonna get some good experience for that because the dragons are worth a lot. Mm-hmm. Uh, so you see that um. Four or no three? Uh, yeah, three. Uh, uh, three giants are up in the top, and they're looking at you, and they're holding something in their hands, just waiting as you approach. Uh, Kira, pretty much. Hi there. We're here to help with the dragon problem. You are an enemy. Take that dragon filth away from us. You too. <laughs> Don't mind the octopus in the party. Yeah, that's funny. Almost everywhere else we've gone, nobody's minded the fact that I'm a walking humanoid dragon and that she's covered in scales. But the moment they see you, oh god, it's tentacles. Now we're talking giants. They're like, Cthulhu Jr., dragon scum. <laughs> <laughs> they talk back to you like, <laughs> like, <laughs> oh, like I'm like wide eyed. What is that? I don't understand what they're saying. I literally should we probably should just continue on around the round house. Uh more or less. She translates Do you know about your goddess phylactery? Setting call. Do you understand call? Why are you yelling this? Tentacles actually says that. Like, why are you yelling that at them? I don't know. Maybe they'll understand. Some of them might understand. You never know. There might actually be a smart giant. Heaven forbid. By the way, if one actually does understand common, that'll be hilarious. Either way, because you guys... Are you rolling to see if one of them understands common? What's your touch, AC? Mine? Try throw them off. Uh, 18. Okay. Alright, one of them hucks... uh, Bag of something at your face. You got to make a fourth save. Mate. Twenty-four. Oh yeah. Okay. Uh, you feel kind of numb. And you're like, oh. Hey, look. It's the maybe we can go around. Wait, is there actually a door in front of us? No. Uh. Thanks. Nearby, yeah. Okay. I'll put it. We are. We're at the round. House. We're at the round house. Yeah. I'm just wondering if there's any. Oh, if there's, okay. if there's, if there's, I was going to say, like, why don't we just break the door down and go inside. We don't even need to go inside. I thought that was, that's one of the areas we thought that the uh, phylactery would have been. That's why we walked towards it, isn't it? No, we need to go to the palace behind it. Oh. Oh, oh you right. mean this thing? No, 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 no. Over here. Keep going. To the right. There you Over go. Over here? Yes. Okay, let's just go there then. Fuck it. Okay, we bypass the house and keep walking. Oh. They're into, like, throwing scare brains. It's like, we'll just move on. Well, they're not... Well... Do they chase after us? They Even though we're like, we're killing dragons for you. They didn't say that. Also, you, you totally didn't do anything to convince them. Would you like uh, us to go grab the dragon the corpses and drag them over? I don't speak giant, though. Oh, yeah, the Kier, I don't know Kier's skills to actually do any diplomacy or whatnot. Probably not as a barbarian. Wouldn't, no. wouldn't, it, wouldn't you be able to prove it by just grabbing a dragon corpse, dragging it across, and pointing at it? Probably. Let's go do that. Okay, sure. I go not. over and I grab one of the corpses and I heave it over and I plop it down. You, you, and you I know say, what? And I point to my sword and I just point to this and then 
We killed two green dragons and four black dragons today. Mm. They're getting ready to throw more brains at us. Okay, <laughs> if they throw a bag, I'm charging up to one of them, <laughs> smacking them in the face. I don't give a shit. Fuck these dragons. Oof. I mean, giants. If they're afraid of the dragons that we're killing, then I'm going to kill one of them. Pass by, but keep away. I'm just going to keep walking, fuck it. Yeah, pr pretty much. They, 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 By the way, how far uh, would you say the uh, the range of a boulder is? When they're throwing it? Uh, when they're throwing it? You pick up the bag. Well, hill giants uh, have a... Uh, Wait, it's a hill giant? Yeah. A hill giant. Poking hur hurler. Speech class. Dude, Sometimes. it's a hill giant. They have, they have special abilities that allow them to throw rocks. They can throw them like ridiculous. Yeah, they can throw them as easily as far as the as the the maximum of like between the tower and the wall. Well, whatever. I'm not caring too much about the hill giants now that we're past them. So there's a flight of stairs there. There's a flight of stairs there. There's a flight of stairs there. So I guess we go down the first flight of stairs. The ones okay. that are right in front of us. By the way, can I make a disguise check so I can hide myself? Do you have uh, what? What are you going to use to hide them? Cloak face. Do you have a cloak to cover yourself? <laughs> well, I have my cloak, my uh, cloak resistance on. So you just kind of place it so your face. Yeah, you can give it a shot. You are and then my cold. hair is like not super long, but sort of long. Yeah, go ahead. This guy, charisma. So that would be thirteen. Okay. To 24. Okay. So probably people can start really probably people notice, but do they actually pay attention enough to notice? Yeah. I'm not too concerned about the, them anymore. In fact, I think that the best step would probably be just to continue. No, it's just more for later. Yeah, I understand. Might be a good idea for later. I'm thinking the flak tree is either in the palace like you thought, or it's on this area right over here. Yeah. Because that looks like a fortress, and if this is the area down here, then it goes downstairs, man, so... Uh... uh walking across, um, Gazelfeck, or whatever the heck his name was, mm -hmm. uh, he starts to speak up. This is the craftsman area of the, of the city. Uh, it doesn't look like it's seeing much use right now, though. No shit. Mm, I was told something about a civil war that was breaking up between the North and South Ends. I don't know much about it, but uh, apparently they had left long before the dragon attack just because of tensions. Uh, hmm. Giants don't seem like the most temperamental. Well, like close. Just a lot angry. I don't care about small gold. Mm-hmm. Like more, more about rocks and a magic powder bag. Uh, okay. No, they're dung beetle. They're super dung beetle parallels and that. Oh, did you just say one of them threw dung beetle shit at me? Because if tentacles <laughs> actually tells Luciana that she will walk around and kill the hill giants. Uh, tentacles kind of points out to you that they just threw a brain at you. Moving on. Yeah, let's get this done. <laughs> Don't. Let's see. Same she had an eye twitch. We'll continue. continue. On our way back, if that place isn't destroyed, she'll um, walk up and kill all of them. You also see a single still functional ballista on, on, the, on the ledge of it, and... Uh, right here? Uh, yeah, on, on the ledge. Well, no, not that one. I, no, probably not. Well, maybe. Sure, whatever. I don't care. Uh, and uh, it's, uh, its hill giant crew is lying dead nearby. Uh, you would have presumed by green dragon breath, just because of all of the melting. Anyone know how to fire ballista? Anyone got the trigger? I'm gonna aim it. I'll just rip it off and carry it up over my shoulder. Seriously, it'll be like a giant crossbow for me. Think about it. If it's a ballista, I'll just you like. You have the dex to aim it though. Sir, I currently have a dexterity of 20. Better than me, I can argue that. Better than I. And I'm pretty sure I could lift it. I almost want to try doing that. I deadlift the ballista. Pull! <laughs> Yeah, meanwhile you go flying back 20 feet. True, but if we put a rope on the end, then we can scale anything. Seriously, there are, there are, I think, three of those chain loads that you heard about. Oh, yeah? Uh, there are three of those nearby. Okay. 
So can we load one of those into the ballista? If you want. Okay, I load it into the ballista. Why? So that I can carry it around as a giant crossbow. How much does it weigh? It's a well, it's a ballista and it's in a giant area. It's pretty heavy. Okay, fair enough. If that's the case, it's probably a giant, giant ballista, meaning even <laughs> I couldn't lift it, so never mind. Uh, well, okay, I think it's actually normal size, but they, they keep calling them ballistas, not crossbows, so... <laughs> <laughs> I just feel like using one as a crossbow would be funny as hell. I use a giant crossbow. You mean a ballista? Yes. Yes, I use a regular ballista, so a giant crossbow. Yes! <laughs> okay, I guess we just move along. Yeah. This is a stupid uh, idea. You guys can... Uh, well, can be smart if you have the people to manage. Aaron. You need well. You need Aaron to aim it. You need Luciana to push in position, and and someone else just keep it balanced. And, yeah. Put board on the end of the actual thing. We'll, be, we'll make like a giant dwarf uh, killing machine. We'll put him on the end of the actual arrow with his axe ready. He'll fly into the dragon. The piercing damage from the arrow will hit the dragon, and then he'll slash into its neck. If that doesn't. Kill and then board full sixty feet. And I catch him. One. Hmm. <laughs> the battery is all disguised now. Yeah. Just blow everything up. And board takes him back. Yeah. Everything misses him. Yeah. Oh, I no, can't. I just resisted. Although I can't wait to see Garrett when he's playing board now, now that he's going to be super tank. 4d6 plus 20 damage. I can't wait to see him kicking some ass now. Uh, you guys can make listen checks. Okay. Glad I failed. I, I hear nothing. 20. I don't think I hear any of the like, oh, well. Cage probably beats me, though. He's got lots of vision. Oh, yeah. That's a 26. Okay, you guys don't hear anything. Oh. <laughs> There's That's new. Things. Yeah. Um, Ninja time! After... <laughs> <laughs> it can happen. It can happen. <laughs> You never know. We're just like walking by a wall. There's like a giant press up against it, but all this dirty body hair and stuff matches it. So we're just like, <laughs> don't you smell something? Yeah, it's dirty. It must just be a giant. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways. Yes. So what happened? Um, after uh, mucking about with the with the ballista for a while, and then like turning to leave. Hmm. Does one of the corpses stand up? Uh, <laughs> that would be funny. Uh, yeah, Q zombie giants. Enjoy that. <laughs> I would rather not. <laughs> I wouldn't mind. I killed undead. Q zombie giant fighters. Whoa. Does it have necropotent? Q zombie giant fighter dragon disciples. Hey, we have all three robots. people who have the, uh... <laughs> the giant necro robots are more special. Playing card games. We're, this is the let's kill undead party. All we need is Aaron now, and he'll be perfect against, like, everything undead. Yeah, except he's now still uh, susceptible to the negative energy and stuff like that. I don't know if we're going to be able to change that. We can't make any of his shit so hard. Unless we make a floating shield for him, too. Well, no, we could still... Do no, it can be added onto his armor. His yeah. armor can go... His armor, we can add the enchantments to make it... Yeah, but wouldn't it just be cheaper to get a floating shield, make it plus one, and then add the uh, the enchant on top of that? It wouldn't only it's, be the run, it's actually more to do that way. Oh, fuck it then. Does anyone else have to spend the... Uh, he has to buy, buy the shield. Uh, chances are he wants to make it metal so he doesn't take armor checks. And then he has to get enchanted with uh, animated, which is plus two. And then, so far, he's got to make a plus seven weapon, and we're increasing it by plus. Fair enough. Wait, what kind of other chances do you have floating? Plus two? Plus two. So far it's like plus seven. Plus five range. No, wait, 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 wait. The shield that we got was a heavy shield. So it has plus three to the uh, armor, right? Mm hmm And yeah, then it's a plus magical. one shield, so that makes it a plus four, right? No, no, it, the heavy shield is plus two. And then if it's magical, it's plus three. It was magical, so also it's got a plus three on it? Yes. It's a plus three enchant. Well, it's not plus three enchant. It's well, two, two from armor bonus and one um, plus one. Yeah, and then the floating doesn't give it any additional. No, it just makes it a plus two. Okay. But it doesn't give you. So plus that means it's a plus. That means it's a plus four shield. So if I wanted to add anything to it, it'd be the cost of a plus five. All right. That's all I need. Well, to know. it's well, it's animate. Wait, is it a plus two shield or what? Well, I know it's getting a plus three shield bonus from it. And it's a heavy shield? Yep. Then it's a plus one with animated, so it's a equal to a plus three. 
Yeah, so that means if all, all I have to do is, oh wow, then all that's going to cost me is a plus four, that's awesome. Which means you have not as much HP though. That's a ballista. Lovely. <laughs> Well, none of us have Kira's character. Yeah, you guys are medical systems. She's not in the fight. Oh, okay. Let's see. Let's see. Yeah, you make your making your way this way. This yeah, takes Kira's not in. Um, all of a sudden, from this direction, your blind sense goes. <laughs> okay. You turn. You don't see anything. Well, actually, no. I guess you just sense. You pin put. He can pinpoint the location for attacks, but he cannot discern its features. So I know what's there. I just can't see it exactly. So it's almost like I see an outline of it. I'm thinking it's here. Dink, dink, majesty. It's a big outline. <laughs> is it actually that? Yeah. Is well, that no, it's not a blue dragon. It's not oh. a giant blue dragon, but it's a, uh, it's a big dragon. You can tell that much. Okay. It's invisible as well. Uh, did you want to fight this now, or did you want to wait until the rest of the group got here? Ah, uh, wait. What is it? Ah, uh, well, we saw the dragons in the sky, and there was like three big blue. Dragon. But he just said that wasn't what it was. Well, I got a question. If we try it now, do we get a reset button if we die? No. No. I would say we... Well, you know what? Let's wait, because it is pretty late. i got work tomorrow, and we might as well do this with the rest of the party. We did make some pretty good headway on it. Okay. <sighs> so... And then now I can bug Marcus for the rest of the experience from before. Yes. From the well, four. Well, for the dragons. Ah. Yeah. I'll do that. Wait, you can do that right now? Not now. Oh, sorry. I thought it was a minute. So does that ring experience or just the four of us? Uh-huh. Will everyone get the experience? Yeah, everybody gets the experience. Everyone gets the experience. Okay. It was silliness before when we were all like, yeah, you only yeah. get it if you What's Aaron here. gone for again? A uh, hockey game. Oh. Yeah, because then that oh, way... Oh, that's right. There's certain reasons that you'll allow the experience to be given for. Remember that before? He's like, if you are gone simply because you don't want to be here, then you don't get experience. That makes sense. Yeah. But if you're gone because That's work and Garrett feels Garrett well, partially Garrett. that, and he doesn't feel safe driving, which is fair because I drove home from work and I didn't want to go back out. Dude, Look. I walked. And I'm like, those roads oh, oh, are shit. I'm like, I'm like yesterday. I'm like, oh, the snow that was supposed to be here and be like all like horrible and bad, not here. Garrett, you know, be fine. Okay, yeah. Whatever. And then I, I woke up today and I step outside. I completely sympathize with Garrett. Yeah. Garrett's, Garrett's in the oh, right yeah. in this one. Ray and I were talking about that yesterday when I picked her up from work on our way back. I'm like, seriously, the road's not that bad right now. Garrett could probably come in. Boosh! Rain, snow, holy shit. It's freaking hell on earth. Driving is a bitch. Driving from work, or driving to work wasn't as bad. It hadn't snowed that much. Driving from work, on the other hand, stupid, stupid people don't know how to drive. They're all over the place. We yeah, actually like, oh my god, it's snow. Oh. So Marcus, just for the record, we're on that part. Just let me pass. You're on that little. Oh, yeah, you're on that little pinnacle there. This thing okay, so I did put the X in the right spot. So just because I carry this thing with me wherever I fucking go, uh, I'm just gonna keep Kira's drawings in here, and if you want, I can hold the map in here. Too. Oh, hang on, people don't care about this. I'll see everyone later in the next thing of oh, Game Day, whatever. <laughs>